We're gonna have a calm, relaxing time. Going through this happy story. We, we got this. We, we, we got this. Who's out? It always starts with this. It's like, now where was I? Oh, I was uh, 66 years ago. So nervous you'd capture the BFR at this time you press print screen twice. Uh oh, was the second one too late? Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah, the second one was too late. Darn. Better luck next time. What's up? What's happening? How's it going, Gino? I didn't say that. that did I? What's up? What's happening? How's it going, Gino? What's up? What's happening? How's it going, dope? How you two doing tonight? Let's go find the next thing I'm a thing. Bible thumb. You'll get it next time, baby. Well, that's a lot. Don't even have to check them all this time. It gets uh, pretty easy to tell. All the other ones that aren't right are much quieter. It's pretty easy to tell with headphones. What we got this time? Wait, where did my ears go? You get me back right now! Yoink! You can't just yoink them! I can't believe this. I can't believe this. All I have is a title screen, your avatar, worthless. Oh, that's it. That's it. That's it. The title screen's amazing, though. I can't believe you stole my ears. Ada's voice wandered about in the darkness, lacking in confidence, as if she was suppressing something. She's like, will I find it? Will I find it? Maybe I will find it. The doctor said I wouldn't find it. I don't know if I can find it. Oh, wait. I just realized I'm not on the right one. This one! <laughs> Details, details. Over there, huh? There's nothing else over here to check out, so I guess let's go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I am getting lowish on fuel, though. Um, I mean, if I run out of fuel, I run out of fuel, right? Uh, GG. Let's, uh, let's die, right? <laughs> Why isn't there anything showing? Unable to detect any substances, huh? <coughs> you okay, Eddie? Um, she's coughing for fun. All right. Your sensors might be malfunctioning, Ada. Should we try again? Of course it's a malfunction. What else could it be? I knew it. I'll never be good enough. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Her confidence is gone. Hey, Geekbot. What's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? Hey, Ivor. What's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? How do you keep missing, Dobie? Well, you know what they say. It takes practice, right? You'll, you'll, you'll get it eventually. Maybe. Hi, hi, hi! doing our first playthrough of Echo of Star Song here. No spoilers, please. We're having a good time. Same old for you, huh? Can't believe this. Can't believe this. Hmm. 
just got to turn it upside down and then then it's uh it's fine you, get, you better get it well you might head chamber triangulate the location and prepare for landing procedures i failed there's nothing to locate system has failed to detect an orbit for entrance uh, stupid computer switch to manual controls Remy, let's do a second pass. We don't want to be stuck in some unknown orbit. I'm landing now. There's nothing here that Red Chamber can't handle. You're the one who's stuck. Ooh. Well, let's go then. Well, she, she's letting me know that uh, it's a bad idea. She's telling me I'm doomed. Are you sure? It's pretty far. We'll need to find a place to refuel when we get there. I bet. I mean, I bet. I mean, uh, she, 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 she's saying, she's saying, okay, you dumb bitch. If you go over there, you're gonna run out of fuel. <laughs> but where was the last place to? Where was the last place to refuel though? Way back over there. I guess we'll go back over there. Buy fuel and come back. Better get it, otherwise I'm gonna turn your avatar to snow and direct a source of heat at her so she melts away! No! That's like rude and stuff, man. Can't do that. Can't do that yet. Let's see, we got plenty of money. Have bought in bulk. I guess we'll buy that. Those two. We don't do discounts. Get wrecked. Am I gonna play Dragon Ball Breakers? I got the platinum in that game. I don't typically stream a game after I get all the trophies or achievements. I, that game was toast, man. That game's toast. It was cool while it lasted, though. Man, look how far it is. She's still giving me the warning. Wait, but... Doc would never give us phony intel. There might be other caves near Zeta. Well... But... It's because it's 12 this way, right? I mean, I, I, you only live once, so uh, let's go. Let's go run out of fuel. Eddie, look what we found! What is this place? How did you find this, Ada? She's just like, I don't freaking know. I thought I said snow and not pumpkin. That would have involved carving! Ooh, that sounds dangerous. Eddie! Uh, sorry. Is this it? It has to be. Remy, get the spare spacesuit ready. I'm coming with you, June. At the time, it felt like Ada was hiding a lot from me. But after seeing vestiges of civilization that had been abandoned for tens of thousands of years... I decided to just let it go. Whoa. Let's explore this unknown location. Maybe they'll give us fuel. For the way back. Alright. Mujuryoku 
We're explore. Well, we get to float around now. Whoa, I can fall out. We're floating. I guess we have little jetpack things. We are, there's no gravity, right? So, here's little jetpacks to go back and forth. This is way easier than in Heavenly Bodies, man. No! I'm just imagining that Darth Vader meme, though. Should we go up, down, or left, right? I feel like it'd be pretty easy to miss a special collectible here with that, since it's not just straight left, right. But who knows? Kodai <laughs> Sure, but it's not a cave, so I don't think you can get ownership of it, so... How would you know that? This guy seems pretty confident. Wait, why did I get uncool points? What did I do? Not my fault you sprint, print screen twice. ショウガクセージ Well, they're speaking the ancient language. We need that dictionary again. That's why I went for every print screen on the beautiful artings. I'd pat, huh? My heart part here in a minute. Whoa, that's cool. Maybe. If they're positive, good emotions, anyway. I have a feeling they're not, though. <laughs> Just like her face, she's like... <laughs> These are sad. Oh, she's upset. Are she looking for her mesh door anyway? Three cool points for saying it's not my fault. God damn it. Doomed. 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 Hmm. I'm gonna check each of these things, see if they have a interaction. Oh, got one here. Arian inscription. Two orbis, five circum, fourteen greatest. The eighty-eight caves, their luster wanes. The sanctum's pain I hear again. The ten peaks and I have toiled long, erecting a hymnal shrine in the void. From here, Terra shall sing unto eternity, to bring prosperity to the sanctums, and keep the Mirian Empire alive. All right, ten, huh? There were ten peaks. Now there's only four, I believe. This is old shit. Watch me miss something somewhere. She went somewhere. That's cool. She probably went uh, further down that hole. Whoa, which is rose leaf. Whoa. Whoa. Not bad. 
Oops. Okay, fine. I guess you can uh, distribute on cool points if you want. <sighs> anyway, Witch's Rose Leaf. It was believed that the consciousness of Terra inhabited Witch's Rose. However, the lack of evidence led to the theory being dismissed. Any plant that grows in a Lumen cave may be connected to Terra's consciousness, Ada said. After all, in Myrian mythology, it was from Terra's song that life blossomed. Hmm. Six cool points. Yeah! She totally went this way. Wait, no way. What do you mean she went down? The only way that's possible to go. ウ。1から考えると、万道13神の序列2。でも、どのガス惑星と対応してるかはわからないな。1からして万道13神の序列3位大東さん。確か Oh, this is like the actual plat, not just the leaf. Six cool points. <laughs> oh, let's see how it works. Let's see how it works around here. Very cool, though. Very profile. Very awesome. <laughs> Which is Rose. This medicine has been banned for a long time. Ada saw countless children in the Witching Tower overuse the substance which made them unable to distinguish between reality and illusion, forever lost in Mirian space-time. Damn. That's harsh. You don't mess with drugs, okay? They're bad. Drugs are bad. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Drugs bad? Okay, that's how it goes. How's it work, then? I have to just surrender, and then I get cool points. If I show defiance, I get uncool points. It's, it's, it's... Who made these rules, anyway? I ruin it with the sunglasses. Too bad. So sad. Shinzo ga naiyen ni haiti sarete ru. Sankai no gaso akse de aru. Seirai san o ishiki shita no ka.心臓が中心から遠くに配置されてるのは南行天村か龍脈教会の本部はあの近くにあると聞いたなうんうんうんなんつわれ<笑> We're going down, down, down. Ooh, can't get that one. It's not broken. Hmm. That's right. Surrender! Give me everything I want. Cash, trophies, money. Get them yourself! You lazy bum. I can't believe you. She's not outside. I'm pretty sure she's just further in. Oh, playing her character now? Interesting. 
Oh, can't go up there. Can't go past there. What's this thing say? I say it. What if I don't want to follow the mysterious orb because I want to look for collectibles? Do you actually want to go that way? Oh, well, I'm going this way now. There you go. How dare you not reward me for going the wrong way with a collectible memory. There, you haven't thought that beyond that, huh? Okay. What is this place? What? What's this? Nothing to interact with. Maybe. Oh, maybe I actually go that way? Ooh. Ooh, it's a big door. Maybe it could activate this door too. あかない。門の先はおそらく最短で奏でることができれば行けるかしら。相手よ。満道は無常。お願いだから。あげて。私だけだよ。だから戻らせて。長老。108号が反国ほど門を叩き続けておりますが。無論分かっておる。My ears aren't totally wasted yet. I can hear it. いれさせますか私は歌えるのにみんなのところに返して私は巫女になれるんだから構うなすでにここの人間ではないエイラどこにいるんだエイラ大丈夫よ。さっき聞こえた声に連れられてここまで来たの。声。ミコは普通形なきものの声が聞こえるのよ。気にしないで。門を開けてみようと思ったけど、私の歌だけじゃダメだった。開けられそうかな。見つけた。
君の歌声を借りるよ。I can't move. I can only press the button. Fine. Zenzen Han no Shinai. Fumemo Fukasashi. Utawiga Warinokara. Tonari de Soreyu no Yameteo, eh? Akiru Hoho Kangayo. Do you mean Bakutoka, Nanika Arutomo? Now I'm free, huh? Do you know what we've got? You can't do art. I'm pretty sure you can do art better than me. To the transmutation thing of things. What? Really? Ah. It's just not the right volume. ああ、どうしよう。そうだ。聞いてみたらどう。捕らわれてた時と同じようにさ。ここの流名は微弱すぎて全然正確な音が取れないのよ。他の方法を考えないと。ここに来る途中、他の流名箱を見かけたでしょ
That was his that was his final words before he activated the Terminator. Hmm. How are you, streamer? Do you feel as resplendent as you look today? Oh, yay! We're ready to play through this cute, light, fluffy, uh, adorable story. With no heartbreak at all. Good, 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 good. So, Miko, you feel that there is a special ability to feel the power of Miko? Yes, yes. Guess we're going up. I can see now. Three Orbis, Nine Circum, Twenty Greatest. Terra sang into the void. For longevity of the Myrian Empire, and to prolong the lives of the Sanctum. I presume the Orbis Circum Greatest thing is like their calendar. Yes, this was August 27th, blah 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 blah. Three Orbis, Ten Circum, Five Greatest. Terra sings her holy song. The lumen gathers, the sanctums grow. Channeled from across the stars, Ignis bellows. Wait, so do I go up or do I go right here? Ah, oh, can't go there. Good, good! There's nothing to read there. Or pipes. Three Orbis, ten Circum, twenty-four Greatest. Indebted to Terra are we the Ten Peaks, for she has granted us eternal life. May Myria reign eternal, and the blessings of Helios be upon all. May Terra's song echo for eternity. Ooh. Fancy, fancy. Guess I activate you next.
ニコはみんな脈動が歌に聞こえるのそうよ神々は歌で語り合ってたからうんおっ、oh, I'm back in this the original first room To do those other pipes too. And do you guys too? I don't know where you originate from though. Oh, there's one here. I guess one to the right. Hmm, to you too, little bit. Hmm, hmm. Puzzles. Puzzles, man. Puzzles. Puzzles in my visual novel. What do they think they are? Zero. Last. Wait. What was it called? Zero escape. Last roar. Something. Near they try to put puzzles in my visual novel. I can clearly see all of them now. Myrian gods, the Ten Peaks. In the Myrian mythology, there were ten planetary gods, known as the Four Peaks of Heaven and the Six Peaks of Earth. But now, there are only four observable, observable planets in Thousand Peaks, and most of them are mired in electromagnetic storms, making it difficult to harvest their resources. <laughs> She's nervous. What's behind that door? Gotta practice some patience, lady. You've been waiting this long, after all. A few more minutes won't kill you. やめなさい。127号。養父の前でブレですよ。いえいえ。このくらいは。お友達にさよならは言ったかい。友達じゃない。4層のやつなんか。また悪い口を。お嬢ちゃん、ごめんなさいね。She does mean that. お腹すいたな。どうして誰も来ないのかな。なんで塔は私がいらないのかな。くれない先生の言う通りにしたのに。
おい起きなさいこんな無様な姿教えていないだろう Who said you could mop around? You're not some peasant. Stand up tall. Wahahaha. Yaku Hachigo. Miko ni naru liu wa mitzkatta no ka? Kurenai sensei. Dou shita? Tou wa... Watashi... Iranai te... Onaka suite nai ka? みんな、私いらないって知っているだから私が迎えに来たのだろお前のようにミコになる理由すらわからない子はいらないと言われた方が幸せだペコペコなんだろペコペコ<笑>行くよお前は私のものだからね私どうに戻れるのその必要はない一緒に船を取りに行こうか船高齢のゴミどもは退職金代わりに退役した流脈探査船をくれるとさ<笑>手続きにかなり時間を食って遅れてしまったごく普通の性能の船だが商船に改造してある私はよくわからない108号子供を戦場に送るような万道巫女の塔は私はすかん私は何か商売をしようと思う一緒に来なさい今日からエイダラムがお前の名前だエイダ龍脈に咲く花の名前から取ったお前の喉を治療している時薬として使った花さふん Hey you're named after medicine we used on you okay? 貿易の目玉になるだろうね一緒にこれを栽培しようこの花が満開になったその時お前は新世代の巫女になるのさあ、oh. I got 21 cool points yeah hey cat what's up sap now's going ah hello hope you're doing well tonight すごいエネルギーの流れ集中しないと絶対に流門を開けられる音があるはずだからあれは違うのか起動させたぞ音は聞こえる待って録音中すまん<笑> Gentle Witch's Star Song ハッパーハッパーハッパーハッパーハッパーハッパー Your level is more XP than when you left it. I see what you've done. <gasps> I didn't do anything. It was me. It must have happened on its own.
She made yourself some cheesy broccoli mashed potatoes. Time for you to invent a teleporter. Even though Ada said that her throat was damaged and she couldn't sing well, her voice rang out like the sorrows of heaven, almost as if she experienced the pain herself. At your calculation, that's 14. Ashen Lawrence and 7C4. It's well done. Uh, your calculations are a little off. That was, uh, 1C4. One, 1.5 1. islands. I didn't stick around for a captain the second time. And, uh, very, very, very good shipwreck. This core. <laughs> uh, uh, that looks pretty tasty. How dare you share your food? How dare you share your food? How dare you make me hungry? That should be illegal. I try and talk myself out of points. Uh, I was just being honest. There's nothing wrong with some honesty. Was I supposed to pretend and be like, yeah, I did all that? ユネバコ力と霊魂を同一視する人もいる。それはつまり君はレイコンとお話ができる。いいえ。ミコはあれをレイコンとは考えないの。ただの残留思念。うん。僕は壁が揺れてることくらいしか。少し揺れてるね。微弱な振動が続いてる。まるで目覚めたいかのように。ビーソムティンイズバトライズ。ワー。ゆるボスト here, here to check out this cool game. Of course, of course you are. Kaito ni ichizuku o skuto chikatta. Dakara, konna tokoro de ashibumi shite wa irare nai yo. Kono hakken wa tobike ni eiyo o motarasu ni chigai nai. So ne. あなたの一族。大丈夫だよ、エイダ。はい、はい、分かってる。一族の栄誉を取り戻すのよね。どんな状況になっても必ず僕が守るから。変なの。ふん。さあ、急いで。次はそっちの番でしょう。わかってる。明海城。共鳴準備。あのね。ずっと謝りたいことがあって。カイトのこと。本当に申し訳ないと思ってる。ああ。彼が怪我したのは私を救うためでも I have a cold? Nah. Just had <coughs> stuff trying to block up my throat. Not cold though. What the heck is that Twitter? That looks cursed. I can't click that. You need 200% volume of this part? Oh. 
Let's see. Look at way up. Twenty percent volume. Go. That's pretty loud. Hmm. Once they go up or down, are those? That would mean. Ow, my ear. You gotta turn your back down. Yeah. You can't have your two hundred percent ball. Try to kill my ears. Roll credits. We totally didn't live to be an old man at the start of the game. I can't read that. I need that in English. A little flashbacks. Oh wait, he's getting like memories from the Lumen. I guess that makes sense. Uh, he's taking a nap right now. <clears throat> yeah, well, what are you thinking, Pyro? What are you thinking? Bah! What's happening with this game? Uh, we're looking for Lumen Caves to that are undiscovered so we can take them back to our clan and be like, yo, we cool, we found caves, and then that will restore honor and will totally not be exploited or whatever. Yeah, sure. Maybe it'll work out. Who knows? Who knows? Nate is looking for her bastard space station, apparently. You just died? I'm, I'm just taking a I'll wake up in a second here. I mean, you couldn't have known what the thing was going to do, so. He's too harsh on himself. Uh-oh, sad flashback. Looks like a visual novel game, is it? Yes, it is! This is a visual novel. I'm the fastest runner for now, is what you actually mean. Oh, he sabotaged him. I should disqualify you, but I bet it didn't. Oh, 
いつも殴られに来るなお前あいつ即位室の子なんだって母上が言ってただからハブられるんだよな乳脈から離れてリバクスが来られないところで遊ぼう僕は乳脈のだんなお。難しい遊びですな。飛びの流脈石板を使ったのですか。どうしました。転んで。ひどいお姿だ。別に。<笑>喧嘩で負けましたか。喧嘩じゃない。彼らに勝てませんか。今回は。何の役だったんです。流門演じがいがないですなちょこまかするなただ動かなければそれでいいってでも動いた当主になってみんなを守れと母上に言われたって教えたらみんな殴ってきたんだよその話はむやみやたらと言いふらすものではありませんぞみんな夢でも見たんだろうって大丈夫自分を強く持ってくださいじぶんがなすべきことをぼくはぼくはもんだよだれもまもれないもんもんもすばらしいですぞ。良くないものは門の外側へいいものは内側にとどめましょう当主の役割と同じですいつの日かお母様と同じように守れるようになりますでも門は動けない何もできないよ今動いてるじゃないですか門を閉じてください一族を離れたい人がいても出られぬようにふん<笑>そんなことしたら怒り狂うよ Definitely not talk about himself. 門の中にいた方がいいのですそして一族を守るものになるそんな人がいればいいけど You're, you're dense, kid. Wow. You must. Waka ga iru tokoro koso. Atosaki kangaize. Hashiri das yona. Ah. Shappy. Kaito. Oh, are we way out in outer space now? There's a space station back there. I guess I was flying out in outer space. I didn't get knocked into a wall or whatever. あと少しでも角度がずれてたら彼方まで飛ばされてもし直撃だったらどこまで飛んでいくかわからなかったのよカイトどうしてどうし僕はリバクああああごめん僕のせいだ僕が悪いんだカイトと約束したのに約束したのにねえトビ家が鉱脈を失った原因も僕
君がマフィアに捕まったのも僕僕がこんな脳なしじゃなかったらリキに感情を支配されないで僕なんかカイトと約束をしたんでしょ一族を救うって<笑><笑>To read the entire game. <laughs> no, wait, wait. Don't forget shit. What's your goal in life? I save your clan. I'm sure they'll be very appreciative. Chirp, 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 chirp. But, 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 He felt this. Aww. Oh. Oh, 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 True, true. You end up going with it, like flying out here, and if uh, you didn't get caught, good luck uh, finding us in the vast reaches of space. Uh, I don't think one spaceship gonna find you. You'd be toast. Going back to the space station. Good idea. We're holding hands now. It's so adorable. Ribak, daishoubu yo. Mai ni mo itta kedo, ryumyak o oi tsuzukeru kagiri, kanarazu aeru toki ga kuru. Boku no yona no nashi ja. そんなこと不可能だよさっきだって助けてくれなかったら二人とも宇宙の塵よ白い牙の時だってあなたがいなかったらどうなっていたかあっあっあそれにこんな古代遺跡だって見つけられなかっただろうし今の自分が嫌いでも魂に誇りを持つことどうほぼえておいてニコーム上。あなたと出会えたこと幸運に思うわどう This game's too sad for me Please find me a happy scene I mean, I mean That part was happy She's glad to have met you We got like a bittersweet thing going on You gotta, you gotta search for the happy and the sad Okay I guess I just, I guess I just press the button. Ano sa. Ano ne. Ah, gome. Ii no yo. O saki ni dozo. Happy. That was sad. The happiest scene you can find. Uh, I'm not sure. I don't know. Maybe. I think I'd have to Google a video of kittens and puppies. Oh wait, go wait. Uh, YouTube video for Boom Boom Rocket. Brave New World. There we go. Ma, Eva. Chosiwa to. Gome. 
もう大丈夫さっき何をしていたのか私は何も覚えてないわうんチュウ本当にごめんさっきのいい話全部師匠からの受け売りなんだ何回も聞いてきたよねなんで流脈を探してるんだってそれは実は探してるのはお師匠なのお師匠はとっても厳格な人だったでもとてもすごい人だったのよ有名な巫女でさ通り名は三階の悪夢高連の英雄私は喉を潰して巫女の塔を追い出された巫女でしかないけどあそうそう私は正確に言うと巫女じゃないのあの当時は名前すらなくて番号108番だけこれが私の呼び名騙されたなんて言わないでよちゃんと流脈発見してるでしょまあこんな私を師匠は拾って育ててくれたの大戦時の食材のために私を新世代の巫女にするんだってでも数年のうちに高齢に再招集されちゃった二度と協力したくないって最初は断ったんだけど。最終的には私を徴兵するなんて話まで出たの私は半人前だけど幼女ってことも知られてたし利用されたのねあっシャオマイン Everything I hear about United Biting is like these guys suck Have they done anything good ever? Imagine if Remy's watching all this Super jealous right now. <laughs> She's just really protective, okay? Just pick something that isn't full of sadness. Uh, you, you know I'm pretty bad at that. Like every game I pl play, uh, this type of game is always sad. You know that's not my forte. I probably couldn't find a happy game if I tried.私は行くって言ったんだけど、ミコの塔を落第した半端者に何ができるって怒られてさ、口が悪いのよね。育ててくれたくせにさ、私はダメな子って。高齢もそれは売り込み済みで、師匠は私の代わりに徴兵に応じ
行方不明の原因は私リバクの考え方で言ったらやっぱりこれは私の責任よねごめん答えられないそうねだから私は助けてもらうのが嫌いさっきみたいにそのせいで誰かがいなくなるの嫌なのあなた結構頭が固いのねちょっとは元気づけてくれないラミオよりダメね<笑>カイトも同じことを言ってたそうラミオも同じことを言ってたっけは本当にすごいなあなたよりちょっとだけ一族のことしか頭にない次期当主真面目な話一族衰退の原因を作ったのは僕だだから僕は一族を救いたいはいはい Sure, sure. This is like head patting, like, yeah, sure, sure, sure.、Uh, that's right. Tozen Dakado, Kimino Shisho San Sakashimo, Tetsoyo. Hi, hi. Hm. Nan da yo, Majimini Tirunoni. Dostan, no? Sinch Tirwayo. Hm. どうしたのよ何でも力が一瞬まぶしくてさ<笑><笑>見てリバ君この光ってまるで花が散っていくようじゃない花俺花ってわからない知ってるよ僕らが集めてる龍脈草加のようなものを英会王室では式典の時に装飾品にするのさ盛大な祝賀会ではよく違う違うそんな少しじゃなくて英会の花の季節は短いって聞いてたけど本当なのね He's never seen a field of flowers before, huh? It t e r u m i g a Wakarana. Ekaiwa Hanaga Skunai Koroko. Watashiga it terunua. Atari c h i m e n i s a k h a n a 一面に咲く花そうまるで海みたいな海そんなにうん想像できないでしょ目の前にある光が舞い散る様子とっても似てるんだ花に詳しいの功労は退役後にお師匠の手で現在の姿に改造されたの流脈の草花で商売しようって毎日毎日たくさんの草花に囲まれた生活お師匠のお家は花だらけでねそこら中に咲いていたんだよ見てみたいと思わないちょっとちょっとだけ海よ花の海<笑> I'm not curious at all 
そこまで言われたら見てみたくなるねなんか乗り気じゃない感じうんそんなことないよエイダの話だから見てみたい I should keep saying this. <laughs> he doesn't even know what he's saying, man. <laughs> oh, she's embarrassed now. And, uh, uh, don't worry, Ada has no idea what he's saying. It's going whoosh right over his little head. I used to be helpful. I used to, huh? You mean I'm still not anymore? Now I'm not helpful? I'm very helpful. Sometimes. あなたの故郷に来てもらうわ。私が大好きなところ。あなたの故郷とは違って、四季があってね。いつも花が咲き乱れているの。I need help. What? No, no, you, no, you. Ada to Atta Samotoshi. Koro wa Kodai no Iseki o Hakke shita. Ada wa Mizukara Mando Fuin Jo to Nazuketa. Ima made to a Kotonaru Ishoku no Ryumeku no Hakke.期待の新人として注目をされ始めた。長売れるという感覚を味わったのは、これが初めてだった。どうね、我々は満道風印所発見者として登録された。エイダの夢も叶い、コールは流脈協会の一員として登記された。さらに数ヶ月後、小惑星帝で移民団の救出に成功。栄誉探査者としての表彰を受けることになった。現代歴8535年、コーロは正式に流脈協会のクルート名簿に名を連ねた。当時、<laughs> Our big wigs now, okay? Seven. Hug wouldn't hurt, ironically. Oh. Back to the present time. Fujidana, Marude, Kino no Koto no Yoni, Kako no Kyoka Ukabiagaru. I need to go get my cup of tea. I'm late now. I'm not leaving. Hmm, can I check out that back there? I don't think so. Star Song Synth Scepter Zoo okay? conferred upon June Lee in the year 8525. What? Kaito. 
私は当主になったぞ。<laughs> Awarded to the Red Chamber crew, Ada, Remy, and June, in recognition for their cultural and scientific contributions to Thousand Peaks in the year 8534 of the Galactic Calendar. She's got some old、uh, memory stuff lying around, huh? Sample source Lumen Ziggurat. Sampler June, singer Ada. Whoa! Oh no. She's not around no more. That's just. There's not、uh, a, a, a together anymore. Is she dead, Joe? Who knows? Neverlasting paths. What comes may not be what you ask. Dang it. This is the, this is the devs telling the, anyone reading this like, if you want it a happily ever after, get screwed. Get out of here right now. Oh, no! これらすべてもし君がいなかったら何の意味も持たないことだった Wow, we made it to chapter three, part one. This one's got part two, part three, part four, part five, part six. Those bars are an indication we're a little over halfway, right? One year after discovering the Lumen Ziggurat, solar alerting post, Star Ignis Orbit. Who in the name of Ignis thought there'd be a cave here? Oh. End the mission now, or we're all gonna die! Why did we even accept this crazy mission? Because it would give us a chance to study the connection between Miria Ignis and East Ocean. Ever since East Ocean was founded, the Lee clan has been. Who cares about your stupid clan? Our ship is getting incinerated! Alright, l stop fighting. Launch the navigator. We're heading back to Guifang. Dang it, but this solar alerting post looks pretty cool. By the light of Ignis, Myria Everlasting. Whenever I'm in Ignis airspace, I think of how the Myrian Ignis Guild would greet us, much like East Ocean greetings. They show a profound respect for the sun. Whoa! Why don't we have 2,500 billion upgrades now? Well, it's been like a year or something, right? We should be like super decked out now. They should have upgraded for me. Dramatic, very dramatic. That's right. Super dramatic. Woo! Three cool points, p r o f i l e well. Achievements always cool. The unmanned solar alerting post operated independently as the flares of Ignis encroached upon the asteroid belt from time to time. Perhaps because of this, in all the many versions of Myria's creation myth, Ignis calls down the wrath of heaven to vanquish Helios, who arrogantly tried to take on his creator. Oh, how could you do that? I guess we're out of here. I didn't need to buy that fuel after all, it was just gonna put me somewhere new afterward. Look, I got messy dolls. Lumen Association, huh? Lumen Mining Application Process. Thanks so much for your help. Dear Red Chamber Crew, Whoever wishes to register <coughs> must have the following information as well as register at the Ironwind Cave Verification Bureau. Cave location, perfect star song from the cave, Lumen Association ID expired. The cave must be in legal airspace. Please note the number of caves that are designated to the Red Chamber exceeds the limit allowed by law. 
so the application may take longer than usual. If you'd like, we could open a special case for the Red Chamber. Fei Lin, Lumen Association Cave Development Office. Wow, well, I didn't realize there was a limit. Application for mining rights, Red Chamber crew. Audit number 3041, okay. Applicant, Red Chamber crew, your application is currently being processed by the association's lawyers. Details, two lumen ziggurat, Red Chamber discovered in 8534, in the process of applying for preservation under the Lumen Association. Three Lumen Cave Red Chamber discovered in 8534. In the process of applying for preservation on Lumen 8535, Iron Wind Cave Verification Bureau first round audit has passed. Whoa! Please make sure to preserve this letter and case code for verification purposes. The Lumen Association fully complies with the Lumen Mining Act and is the only organization in Thousand Peaks that can legally register civilian caves. Wow! We got three now? Technically, that first one's a space station, kind of, so not really technically a cave, but still cool. It's okay, I'm sure you'll lose them cool enough. Cool enough, soon enough. Never good at keeping hold of them. You're just too strict or something, I don't know. Ironwind Immigration Letter of Gratitude from Ironwind Immigration Company. Or not company, convoy. Dear Red Chamber crew. This is Tower, I guess we'll call you that. Red crew leader for Ironwind Immigration Convoy number 328. Thanks to the help of the Red Chamber crew, the lives of all 1,372 passengers aboard the immigration vessel were saved. I pray that the Flaming Hammer continues to eliminate your journey. We wish you smooth running. May fire and iron light the stars. Well, that's a very professional thanks. Wait, what? Another one? Why aren't you up here? Why are you just for Ada? Limit Association Excavation Permit Renewal. Dear leader of the Red Chamber crew, Ada Lynn Grant. It has been one year since you've joined the association. Your excavation permit has been renewed as of today. Please preserve the attached electronic certificate. The Lumen Association fully complies with the Lumen Mining Act and is the only organization in Thousand Peaks that can legally register civilian caves. Wow! Look at this cool award we got! See, we're officially hip and um, honorable. We're, we're cool. We are very cool. We're very profile. We're very awesome. How strict you should simply do better. God dang it. What? I, I, I refuse. I'll just keep being myself. <laughs> Honorable Want Renner's Award. Among all the memories of my journey, this was the most meaningless. What? He didn't like his award? Given all the invaluable ruins that the Red Chamber crew has uncovered in Thousand Peaks, we hereby confer its crew with this award and a level 1 excavation permit to thank them for their contributions. Ada, Remy, June, 8534 Galactic Calendar. I can't believe this. That's it. Not even more messages for Bones telling me I'm a piece of shit for recommending he join the military. Return to Gwen Fang for resupplies. You guys nuts? Red Chamber was almost cooked. Oh, dang it. But I wanted to s s visit the sun. It looked cool. We gotta go to Gwen huh? All right. Let's go. Oh yeah, I get lots of head pats. That's because I'm very pro for wow. Whoa. That's what the echo. あの声が力は不祥不滅の存在宇宙を徘徊し異なる時空に異なる形で存在する夢の中でそれを捉えるのは巫女の素質があるという証拠怖がることはないはい夢の中の声人の歌声みたい I'm not going to 
この声に歌で答えたいのにいつも歌おうとすると6つの光が私を見つめるのそして声が出なくなるでも向こうの歌声は止まらない私を呼んでる声エイドごめんでもそろそろ起きないとこれは非常に安全な睡眠ポジションだよ。You dead. He's tired, car. What about outside the stream? Hmm, not really outside the stream. Except just Chloe. Chloe gets all the head pass, yeah. She gets all the head pass. Good night, Bessie. Good night, Gino. You take care of yourself. You have a good sleep. Eight hours minimum. Required. It's like an order. Totally. Sure. I'm gonna go to sleep. Unlike Ada here. Taksan Shirio Yonde Rukara Shikatagonai Kotosa Koren Gumbukara, Serai Son Kiro Fkino, Lumiak Tansa Yosega Kiterukado. Pass Kore Kyokayo Tosanide. Like how she was just like, pass, pass, pass. It is just like me right now, late night gaming. What? She's working real hard. She's definitely not playing Minecraft on that laptop, okay? Henshin, o n e g a i s o s a k b a n g o 04423, Kuzu h a k u r e n a i 情報がいただけない限り返信はないものと考えたし I'll help you if you tell me what I want to know じゃあ無視しておくよミコ妖精に使われるのが見えてるマンド食流紹介からも妖精来てるこの前やったばかりじゃない流脈協会は再度拒否したら今後の斡旋はしないって何それ脅しそりゃ十個も案件を断ればね怒るのも無理はないむしろ感謝されたりないくらいだって<笑> uh, I don't care about what you've done for t h o u g h I just want you to do more it's never good enough okay more 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 Playing solitaire free so? Hmm. That seems very plausible. Mata d e n c h i g e Oh. Tabun. Saikin with Taiski Kana. Scotchy, Yasun the Hogai. Ja, Mo, you make a misker at a Kunaruketo. Nani meter no. いや何でもはあうんああっうんかあっいやあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっ In those few years with Ada, we marked out all the caves we had explored on this star map. By Tai Ang's mercy, I thank Lumen every day for bringing me to her. Not a day passes that I don't miss the, the time we spent together. Oh. Well, apparently, this is the collectible room here.
Let's go to the uh, collectible room. Which is Star Song of Ignis? The sun of every planetary system has its own unique star song. At the time of our exile, Kay searched among the different stars and asked me to choose where we would go. The equipment used to record the star song from Thousand Peaks was old, and the sound quality wasn't good, so I don't know why I cried the first time I heard it. A strong sense of longing was why I chose it as our destination. Oh, Ooh, Ada star songs. She's got a bunch. Let's see. Source Lumen Cave 745, recorder June Lee. Source Lumen Ziggurat, recorder June Lee. Hmm. At the time, for the convenience of cave running, I took care to look after the star songs that Ada had recorded. To this day, I still miss the sound of her voice. What? You can't use them to listen any time? Hmm. Got anything that's not the two of them? Not that! Wait, all I see got his family tree just chilling here. When, when did he bring that on board? He been carrying that with him the whole time? Can't believe this. Lee Clan Family Tree. Wow, it gives me a bunch of luck. Jeez. The genealogy of the Lee Clan, which records several Taiyang solar flare storms that occurred over the generations and the children that were born during them. Since I was born during one of these storms, my mother had great hopes for me and believed that the soul of Taiyang was within me. But after my mother died, no one else ever brought it up. You're like, yep, never mind. Let's see. Would this camera move any slower? We'll check out this teapot. Wait, I can't check out the tea kettle? Hmm. Sorry, uh, I think we've only got the two people now. Let's try her. I wonder. I wonder. I wonder. A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.A.K.
We're just having a moment here. Oh, I can move the camera. Uh, I thought they were having a moment of silence where they're just like, Did you actually just say that? Oh, wait. It's just her now. Uh. Topic changed! Dodge! She dodging those bullets. She dodging. Master of dodgeball. <laughs> well, she was just checking the day, too. <音声><音声><音声><音声> Oh, he's like, I can't get attached. He's gonna leave. He's gonna leave. I think it's too late. I think you're already attached later. It's too late. It's too late. Is it just her again? What are you staring at, though, What are you staring at? Huh? <laughs> I have so many laptops now. Minkabashi <laughs> dodge it? That's what you're staring at? Wait, 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 wait. I can dodge better than that. Watch this. Uh, it wasn't me dodging, it was Ada. She dodged the heck out of that subject. She dodged the heck out of it, man. Ooh. Three standard years ago. Time for Remy. It's time for Remy to get her backstory. We don't know too much about her yet. Let's go. Mafia もう やっぱりお師匠を探すのは無理。お姉様。機械に頼らないと声も出せない私の気持ちなんて分からないよね。何してるの？ふん。流脈狂心気起動。ちょっと。<笑> 
増幅器起動やめなさい普通の人が使ったら神経の負担に耐えられないから神経系システム接続手を離して何がしたいの分かんないよ私に何ができるのか歌いたくないなら私が代わりに歌うしかないじゃんバカねこれはあなたの問題じゃないでしょ絶対に見つかるもんリュウベク協会にだって入れる功労もアップグレードできる恒例の行動感染も解かれるコクリュウの情報だって手に入るもうやめてそしてお師匠と一緒に帰る出発前に言ったよねどんなことが起こっても私なら分かったから私歌うから私たちならできるあ何泣いてるのよ泣いてないしラーヤShe shouldn't be getting her hopes up just for what email. I gotta get there first. Koro, one is a man of Kaisen or Hirite. Chandel Zero Zero, Ada, Miss Sok. One is a man, he got it. Die, 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 you see. Or in a Can't. <laughs> June from get. Oh my gosh! Who invited this loser anyway? Koro, Ribak's transmission record is lost. Wait, what? Then, all transmission records are lost. Everyone, Ribak uses personal access. Access is not やっぱねパケット分析するっきゃないか Too much trouble to just get up and walk over to his room Space stations or space, space vessels too big man You dodge and you just punch up the middle and get you there You dodge into it Oh man that sounds that sounds like a plan You're like dodge 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 Dodge, 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 dodge. Pow, 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 pow. I can't believe you. Don't worry, I got all. I, I, I played like zero fighting games. I got the combo buttons. I know what to press. Totally. That's right. That's right. Koro, the latest network transmission data. Show me. ロード中うっく何この数一つ一つ見てたらキリないじゃん That's a lot of numbers and letters That means nothing to me もしリバクの使ってる装置の認証番号が分かれば記録も抜けるあそういえば前に一通来てたこれで解析できるねコロリバクから来た一番新しいメールをチェックしてクルーメンバーシップフィーセンターチュー見るだけでイラつくレシーバーレミー You're late time to pay up I inquired Ada about the membership fee and was told there is no such thing You sure are a person of honor Perhaps there is a misunderstanding. Dude, like, like, why does he type so fancy? Like, why can't he just say "Yo, pay up, bitch"? Yeah, yeah. So, I just want to see what I should be looking for. What? 
確かあれ系の装置の認証キーは前列4セットが0000の後ろの文字8セット。Huh? Oh, well, they're gonna puzzle me. Oh, no. Ah! Uh, eight, wait, uh, the eight digits after the zeros. Uh, wait, what? Going left to right or up top to bottom now? Hmm. Shut up. I don't understand this puzzle. Shut up. Shut up, Remy. How dare you say not this one? Stop, stop explaining this to me. The eight digits right after the fourth. Fourth from this direction? Uh. Two. Three. That's not four. Three. Uh, four, this one? Oh, okay. Could match the first few digits. Oh, well. That part's easy. I'm funny. Um. Thank you, thank you, thank you, I think. I think. Maybe. Possibly. Remy's intercepted communication records. Subject June, Ada. Time 8535. Oh, 910. 40, 20, 23, 1. Blah, blah, blah. Reference blah, 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 blah. I'm not reading that. Ada. I'll stop by later. June. If you come over too often, Remy is going to get mad sooner or later. Oh! She's feeling called out right now. Hey, Mexican boy. What's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? I'm doing pretty well. Continuing my first playthrough of this game. We're, we're in chapter three now. It's very cool. Very, very exciting. ガキ、ピシ逆側に降りたい。あ、ちょっと待って。こっちの通信記録って。ね。ね、リバクちょっと。お。どうした What's this game? Oh, no, 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 no,
It's just great. What's this game? This game is a visual novel called Opus Echo of Star Song. We're, we're having a good time going through this very happy, not at all sad story. I'm lying to you right now, by the way. Hydrate. Okay. Stretch too. What? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I felt that. We found caves for the clan, huh? That's the title of the sure. Surely get their attention. Trying to keep me alive? You're gonna keep me alive. You keep me alive. Drink more water. And stretch more. Uh, stay alive. For the past few years, I brought honor to the family name. Many unexpected things have happened. Let's go with that one. So, so stay tight, Johnny. Should you need me? I met my call. A woman I met helped me in finding them. She's a Marian witch. Woo, able not like that. Aren't the, aren't the East Ocean guys supposed to be anti-witch? Yeah, these guys don't care about me anyway. Let's piss them off in an email. Let's do it. Drex will grant the clan access to a wealth of resources. She helped me greatly. I owe her too much. I wait your orders. I'll let run for my responsibilities. I'm just picking like second option for everything. Save it for later or send the message. Send it. What are you thinking? The second option was was false then. He's not gonna send it after all. Maybe you have to, like, stand up and accidentally press the enter key and send it. Ugh. Or whatever. Accidentally click send. Oopsie, my bad. Message date, 8535-921. Subject, newfound caves for the clan. Sender, June. Receiver, Shenley, clan master. Oh, this is the email he wrote. Over content, over the past few years... Many unexpected things have happened. Beyond my greatest expectations, I have accumulated partial rights to a large number of caves. A woman I met helped me in finding them. She's a Mirian witch. She helps me greatly. I owe her too much. I will not run from my responsibilities. <laughs> Oh, fine talk. What are you fine, huh? Oh, we were going to talk about Banshee, but okay. I'm not sure they ever did read the letter. He's being ignored, man. He's been talking to them, but they've been ignoring him. I'm in contact with them. They don't give a shit about him. Come on now. I'm surprised they haven't sent more assassins yet. Give it time. Give it time. This is the same text, even after time skip. Did the association really find Banshee, Doctor? What do you think, Big Shot? 
Are you trying to get in trouble by turning down every request? You have a special mission this time. But first, we're going into to the headquarters in Mount Aurora. Headquarters? Don't interrupt me. <gasps> the free city of Mount Aurora is where the Lumen Association was founded. The Council of Ten is requested to see you. I also have some business there. We can go together. What? Am I not allowed to board the ship I used to work on? No. I can't believe that your search for Red is coming to an end. It's just all very sudden. I never thought I'd actually have a chance to find her. Is that so? Neither did I. I hope you'll be able to move on with your life. You no longer have to chase her. Obtain coordinates, Mount Aurora. Wow! Your dog brings you the same toy. I wonder if it's his favorite toy or if he thinks it is your favorite toy. Hmm. Hmm. Well. I'm going to go with option A. That's my guess. After I returned home, I often wondered if things would have been different had I noticed that Ada was subconsciously avoiding Banshee. Well, if if you if you reach the end of your journey, then then we can't stay together. We must go go our separate ways. Plot twist, you're the toy. Oh, you're the toy! You're the toy tossing the other toy. For for the dog to chase. Stay out of trouble, will you? No. What do you want? Um, I want to see if you got anything new. I, I got I got to uh, sell stuff to buy stuff, I guess. I got to buy some... I got to buy some... Stuff. Let's see, we need 15. Fifteen hundred. We could buy a few. We already got everything else, so who cares? Where are we going now? The coordinates. More messages! Oh, I got two messages. Oh my gosh. Let's see. It. First up, personnel transfer notification. Uh, it's about Dr. Russell joining us. Uh, it's urgent, huh? Formerly, formerly head of the association's Guifeng branch, Rachel Moore has been promoted to the position of Executive Secretary General for her help resolving cave issues between United Mining and the people. She will now be responsible for operational management, intel development, and cave expansion for all caves in the Thousand Peaks region. The above position transfer is effective immediately. Dang. I hope she gets a big pay raise. Well, that's her letter, right? Found info on Banshee. Got some Banshee info. Come back to Guifeng ASAP. Eddie's too busy to check her messages, but we're on the move. We'll head back immediately. Tell her to stop caring about the Oceaner boy so much. Ha! Dr. Russia Limit Association Executive Secretary General. Hey, that's different. She's just Dr. Russell for it. Now she's got a fancy title. Head of Guife Bread. She's got a fancy title. Whoa. How is it in the military? He joined the military? He managed to, he managed to convince them to join. At the East Ocean Lee Clan report. If you're willing to help, I would be extremely grateful. Noble, if you want to research your family, do it yourself. Don't go through the Lumen Association. And if you're going to leave, do it quick and don't bring Ada into this. Oh. She's like, stop, stop, stop getting Ada involved. Russell can tell what's going on. How is it in the military? Really happy to hear you're back in the service and giving back to society. Gee. God damn it. 
Yeah, life in the service is like clockwork. Sleep early, get up early, three hot meals a day. You're one annoying brat, you know that? They gave me a little crew here at United. There's some dodgy noble who acts all pompous and crap. Reminds me of you. Good thing he's not from East Ocean or I'd give him a good beating. Anyway, I've been pretty busy recently. Since the security clearance for this mission is the highest possible, I can't use standard communication during the operation. Next time I contact you, it'll be about half a standard year later. You take care. Lawrence White, huh? Ha 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 ha! Uh, see you half a year later, I guess. It was that was actually kind of polite. Uh, is he feeling okay? It almost sounds like a friend now. Huh? <laughs> if this intel on Banshee is coming from the Council of Ten, there's a good chance it'll lead us to Red. Uh, I have my doubt. Do, 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 do. We have anything cool we haven't explored yet around here? Looks like we've done all the ones around here. Look over there! We don't know what that is! That's outside scanning range, though. It's been a while since the last time I was here, when I met June. Why isn't Remy here yet? Is she still going through docking procedures? Hey, where did all these people come from? I think there's going to be some sort of performance. An opera called Melody of Star Song or something like that. I've heard this is real. Local Thousand Peaks culture, right? Should we try to get a seat? Helios and Tara's love story. So awkward. Should I? <laughs> she doesn't want to sit here and listen to this shoppy love story, man. Weren't Red Chamber famous already? Ah, after discovering those caves and stuff. Uh, well... I guess they're kind of famous. They, they helped the convoy. They got that cool award. But you gotta keep a bond. That. It's never enough. There's always more they want. You might be, quote, famous, but there's always more. There's no, they're never enough. Never enough. I'll ask, ask you for more. I'll be very cool. Hmm. Uh, I mean, I mean, it would be way too romantic if you did it without Remy, right? 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 What are those people you plan wait for? The crowds grew larger and larger, and by the time Remy found us, we had been pushed to the outer perimeter. We could hear the beautiful melodies coming out of the temple, but only barely made out the performance on stage. Ah. Obtained melody of Star Song Act 1. Wow! Head pirate! You want to listen to it? Well, we got shoved out to the outer edges, so we heard it, but we didn't get to see much of it. Can't believe this. Stare. Blink. Blink. Melody of Star Song, Act One. Melody of Star Song is an opera about a love between two gods, written by the Rodin family, after years of gathering archaeological research. The first act describes the birth of Helios from the fires of Ignis, and how he was ordered to watch the peaks from the void, drifting aimlessly for millennia, tormented and alone. 
One day he was drawn in by a mysterious voice. Where there is song, you shall find me. Terra, one of the gods, gazed at Helios from afar, hoping to save him with her song. Eventually he came down from the heavens for her and they fell in love, establishing the Myrian Empire. That is just way too shabby. We're almost at a hundred memories now. Hmm. You're the Red Chamber crew, right? Better watch out. Crime rate in Fortune 9 is at an all-time high. Hey, I heard you guys busted a pirate operation at the Migrants Bazaar back then. You should come share your experience with us. Once we have the budget to pay you for your time, of course. Ignis above, the Red Chamber crew. I finally found you. I could get a space station for this, but I need the cash. Alas, such opportunities are better left for great runners like you. Mm-hmm. Uh you ever heard of the ominous star song? <laughs> Banshee? What? Did you say Banshee? You just said Banshee, right? Ada is way too excited, and the price is ridiculous. What should I do? I mean, I'm kind of broke? So... Kind of broke. And I... Uh, even if I had the money, it's only a 50-50. It's quite tough. Not bops! Hey, Pippi Mint, what's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? Hey, King, what's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? We don't have the money. Even if we did, it's only a coin toss. Excuse me, have we met before, peasant? Oh, no, no, no. There are 66 members in the Capybara Merchant Society. Whoever that was, it was either my friend or my friend's friend. He started backing away as he spoke. And before I could ask any more questions, he was gone. It's toast, man. Hmm. Ooh. Ooh. Man, I keep finding stuff for June's luck. Ooh. Well, clearly I need the uh, uh, some money here. I do have some money. Hmm. I don't have very many of those, though. Hold up. Obviously, we gotta get that. Reliving the past. Acquired over a hundred items. Actually, this is actually... This is exactly a hundred. Not over a hundred. This is at one hundred. So... You know. Lumen Intel bought on the black market usually just led to caves that had already been explored, and there was always the risk of being ambushed by pirates. Ugh. You saying I just wasted my money? The identification field guide includes 270 commonly seen lumen plants, highly recommended by the Lumen Association. Besides visuals and plant descriptions, it also provides various common and med medical uses. Great for experienced and novice users alike. Fine, I'll buy it. Mm, freaking buy it. 
I'll buy your stupid thing. At the time, I didn't understand why Red Chamber had a greenhouse or where Ada's passion for flowers came from. I mean, I mean, by this time, I knew. But. But we must buy all the cool collecting mumbles. They're required. Hello, cat. What's up? How you doing, cat? I know, right? So many scammers. Well, I hope you enjoy Alan Wake Rebastard. I need to get around to playing that sometime, too. One of these decades. This text primarily describes how Helios and the other gods work together to build the Lumen Empire. Helios is known as the deity who created the Myrian Empire. He fought against the omnipotent Ignis for the good of the gods. And this romantic nature made... Er, okay. And this romantic nature made him beloved by adventurers and scientists alike. As such, he is believed to represent the pursuit of progress. I see. Cool. More fuel. We are broke again. <laughs> Something I was curious about. Yeah, if I hold on to the plants, I could get them for an even better price. I like how her face changes on each upgrade. She's just like, Ugh. Yay! Ugh. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> about the Lumen Cab? Where's that? That's way all the way over in... F what the fuck? Uh, that's the way, wait, way over there somewhere. You guys trying to get me to uh, break the bank? Really? Oh, wait, where? Wait, where are we right now? Well, that's where we're supposed to go. All the way down there! Jeez. That's true! I'm tempted to go check out that cave. I'm gonna run out of fuel. I'm gonna sell all my plants and run out of money. I wonder if you can go back to a cave and get more supplies from it. I haven't tried it yet. Hmm. I'm gonna run out of uh, fuel. It's gonna be very cool. Let's do it. Let's die because we ran out of fuel. Oh, you actually can use a kit to get more stuff. Cool. Even though I'm pretty sure I've done it before. Pretty sure I've done this area before. Maybe it recharges after a while. What's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? Hmm. Oh. I mean, uh, this is... That's Ben's expiration kits, though. Maybe I'll get something cool, though. I'm pretty sure I did this before, though. 
put a small amount of excavation equipment in their warehouse. The digital contract was sent to me, and we all agreed on how much we'd earn. That was life in the peaks, and to this day, I still haven't learned. Way. Wait, so... Holy shit, there's a bunch of shit over here, isn't there? Although, what the heck's over here? Isn't this where that cave was supposed to be, though? Oh, wait, I got a Rezo scanner, right. Just doing the fast forward one. Chaotic, huh? Chaotic Witch's Star Song. A witch's imitation of the star song from deep within an asteroid, revealing a facet of the lumen it holds. Cool! Let's go check it out. Uh, we have like no fuel though. We are so dead. Moon Cave Tula. This cave was discovered after endless hardships by Groundhog Tula at 8529 of the Galactic Calendar. Led by Tula, the Groundhog crew established itself over many years, comprised of system has blocked lengthy messages. Dang it! Geologically unstable, abandoned due to pirate activity. Uh oh. He's like, are, are, you, are you crazy? Are you crazy? It's true, we do not have very much fuel. Let's go buy more fuel, I guess. Should that be fuel here? Yeah! Well, I only have plants now. Ooh. But if I wait till I get my extra bonus, I'd get like 1500, right? I don't have enough plants. We're gonna run out of money. Not gonna be sad. So the trick's probably to uh, go explore everything and get all my fuel back. Use my exploration kits like I was doing before, since apparently they've refreshed. Tula, aka the Groundhog, was the first to discover this cave. Even though it was registered with the Lumen Association, its location in the lawless asteroid belt meant that it had already been looted dry. Woo! A withered Lumen plant leaf. Wow! If a cave was improperly handled during excavation, the Lumen would gradually dry up causing the leaves of lumen plants to form crystals that were often used for religious purposes. Oh, we got an inscription, huh? Inscription! Fourteen Orbis, four Circum, eight Gradus. Presidio composes thus. I sing once to offer one hundred caves from afar to Ignis. Ignis roars and the sanctums begin anew. I sing again to offer one thousand caves from afar to Ignis. Ignis roars and the sanctums live on. All right. Let's 
Came all the way over here for that? I can't go over this way, can I? These are too far to scan. Is this it? We can't get in the, there yet. We're not allowed to go that way yet. Yes. Hmm. We gotta make our way back, I guess. Nothing here. Before all the cities have cool things. We gotta figure out how to make money again. To make coins. Ha! Just drop by when I need the credits. I need the credits! Hmm. She, she says that, but, uh... I guess she doesn't uh, uh, really do it until you actually need some help. Whoa. Am I screwed if I keep going this way? Maybe. Uh, you only live once. Let's go. Let's go die. Oh. I can't explore this place. Carried more fuel. Oh, nothing here for me either. I'll just go lose all my fuel and die. Let's go. Really? Can't do anything there either. Make sure to keep the resupply facilities within range. I heard Ada saying that we've been running on a tight budget. There must be some way to make some credits. <laughs> what do you want? You want to shoot yourself into space? No way that's happening. You're way too heavy. Oh, space waste sweeper. Yeah, let's do it. Let's get make some mundas. Actually, I remember reading this. He found his new job. Ooh, can we just do this over and over? Ooh, yeah. I'm not going to fail it, right? Yep, oh, it kicked me out. It was like, you can't abuse this for infinite money. How dare you. Oh, it gave me plenty of these. They're not worth very much, though. Gives you enough to, to survive until your next trip, right? How dare they not let me farm this endlessly and get a bajillion dollars? Hmm. Oh, 
Oh, actually, I haven't been there. Never. Wait, is it? Was it? It's in like its own circle. Would it have been too far from the other side? Hmm. Let's go down, back down there. Oh, it's this guy. I would never let someone do the running for me. These ocean runners were born chasing Lumen. We must feel the pulse of Lumen ourselves to maintain our dignity and honor. That's right. Dang it, why didn't you just go down there yourself? You didn't have any warning signal? Orbit 8, Sentry Station, Danger Military Base. Oh, let's go get blown up! United Mining, Sentry Station, present airspace verification, or present airspace verification when approaching. United Mining reserves the right to attack intruders. Let's go get blown up! Let's do it! Oh, man. Morning. Incoming solar flare from Star Ignis arriving in 30 seconds. Uh, 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 waited out in the anti-radiation shelter. Ignis, the star of Thousand Peaks, was notorious for its highly unstable solar flares, which appeared frequently in myths of divine retribution. We sat and panicked in the safety shelter as the ship's alarms blared and all systems went haywire. Whoa. This is a warning to the vessel ahead. You have entered United Mining airspace. Please leave immediately. Why are there even troops stationed at the border sentry station? Oh no, I don't have a forged military visa. Oh no. Oh no. You need forged military visa. Oh no. Well, I guess I have to die right now. I'll probably die doing this. For a while, we thought we had gotten lucky and passed through enemy lines, but a rail cannon sniped us from a distance. The last thing I remember was a blinding flash of light. Yep, I died. Okay, so let's not go that direction. I need a forged military visa for it. You're bad. That's only like the fourth time I've died in this game. Come on now. いや、待て待て。もしそんなことがあったなら、私はなぜ今ここにいるのだ。もう一度思い出そうじゃないか。あの時、私が何をしたのかを。Alright, so leave military base alone. Proof you wrong. It's like an impossible mission. Impossible. I cannot. Mm. Wait, where am I? I'm at the place before going over there. Okay. Oh, uh, let's not go over there. Let's see if I can do any jobs here. It seems to give you jobs. It seems to give you jobs, uh... If you need it. If you can't get wherever you need to go without more monies. You don't have enough fuel to get to the next destination. Where? Well, I'm dead. Let's go spend all our fuel. 
Dang it, what what if I wanna just lose my fuel? I'm gonna explore this one. Probably gave me pity stuff. No warning this stuff. You're supposed to be impressed by that? You're supposed to be very impressed by that. Hmm. <laughs> Let's do it. I don't know if I've read this one or not. I was in a bad place at the time. Whenever there was some way to help the crew, I put everything into it. It made me feel like I was still able to hold on to my pride. The administrator was pleasantly surprised with my work and he compensated us fairly. Cool. Good, you were impressed by that? Yeah! But it only lets us do it twice. Oh yeah, wait, wait, wait. That's what he said the first time I was here. He said that. It's designed to make sure that you can't run out of fuel. Can't run out of money to get fuel anyway. I can't just hold the button down. Darn it. It's totally fell. Ooh, should we do that? Well, uh, actually, if we do that, we're probably gonna die, right? Orbit three Century Station. Yeah, I can't. Yeah, it's gonna do the same thing. We need that forged visa. Oh, man. Hmm. Wait, really? I guess I have to go back to Fortune 9. First. That is so silly. How dare they do this to me? Come share your experience with us once we have budget to pay for your time, of course. Oh, lo, lo. so I'm not doomed yet. we will buy one fuel. Boom. Let's see what this one is first. Lumium Orbit Cannon Os. United Mining Announcement. Uh, I can't pronounce that. Zhao Ge Zhao. I can't pronounce it. Resources has been found guilty of concealing weapons and the improper use of energy resources. Industrial abandonment procedures have been initiated. Ooh, cool. There's an unidentified spaceship that has been trailing us for some time now. They just sent us a message. I'm putting it through. Are you really the Red Chamber? Boy, have I been looking for you. You're the ones who wiped out the Bones Brigade, right? I'm a new guy over at the Daily Lumen and, and I'm writing an article about you. Could I come on board and get a better understanding of the crew? Uh, that's way too risky. I had no idea we'd gotten this famous. June, you're stupid. 
What kind of words tell you what really happened? Sounds suspicious. Say no. You can tell them what happened over the fucking communicator radio thing. Like, come on, man. Oh. See, we made a correct choice, I think. Bones Brigade, this is for you! That was the last thing we heard before the signal cut out. The firepower on that trading vessel was not that of some common peddler. He unleashed a hail of gunfire, and Red Chamber was barely able to make it out. Jeez. So even with that, if I picked the other option, we might have straight up died. Though. He probably would have stabbed us. I'd have to totally pick the other option in the next playthrough, right? Get stabbed. Die. Ninth year of the Lumen War. The powerful Lumium Cannon, once the source of strength for various factions, was rendered useless once the witches entered the picture. Due to its reliance on Lumen, they were able to track its location, leaving behind only ruins and debris. Ooh, I think this is new stuff. It is! You know what that means. Time to collect... This is what United Mining and Zhao Gei, hey, I don't know, were fighting over. The doctor was the one who told me about this. During the war, United Mining was worried that Lumium simulation technology would be used for military purposes. So they ordered her and Red to intercept Zhao Gei's chip transport vessels. Okay. Provisions pack. Tasty stale food. I mean, it's better than no food, so... I'll take it. Special provisions made by Zhao Gage resources. The Lumium added additives increased endurance, concentration, and other physical attributes. After Zhao Gay left a thousand peaks, you could only find them among the ruins. Let's see. We can upgrade! What we upgrade? All the plants. Now I can sell the plants. I don't think there's a bigger upgrade past that. Doesn't look like it. That's an upgrade like this. We may as well be working in the plant trading biz full time. Even the engine room smells like flowers. Not that right. Hmm. I don't have any of this stuff. <sighs> Tasty, that's right. Well, let's check out this one next. Lumium Refinery, Irwa. United Mining Announcement. This refinery is legally designated as a public space and will be reconstructed in 8537 of the Galactic Calendar. Trespassing and filming are prohibited. T too long, didn't read that part. Ninth year of the Lumen War. After the East Ocean Transport Station was destroyed... Zhao He was unable to get supplies, and United Mining had sealed them off from all sides. Once a leader in Lumen Processing Technology, they were they were two were burned in the fires of war. Rawr. By the blessings of Helios, just the man I need. June of the Red Chamber crew, right? Uh oh, he knows me. Perfect timing. Could you give us a hand and help us figure out what happened to the soil? The Lumen Association was commissioned but to fix the whole joint, but United Mining really screwed up this old refinery. The pulse of the Lumen is a mess. Can't even get a reading on the soil or the water. Ada, the refinery is probably built on a Lumen cave. With my excavation skills, I'm sure I could help. We're looking for caves. Let's head to Mount Aurora and quit wasting time here. Four. You mean spend four? Four. 
You know, if I do this though, I get a, a once in a gameplay character map out, right? Totally. Be nice is for next playthrough. The leader of the excavation crew knew Red Chamber had its own work to take care of. So after bidding us farewell, he went back to work. Oh. Wait, standard signal. Grand Crusade Memorial. Phew. Not not a military station, not gonna murder us. Glory to the United. May fire and iron light the stars. This memorial was erected in memory of warriors who had passed. Andrew, Talus, lengthy message, names have been blocked. Screw you guys. You dead. Who cares? Message too long. I see you've kept the ship in good shape. Thanks. It's been ten years since you've been on board, hasn't it? Does it remind you of Red? Not even close. I told you already. Don't try to be her. Your next stop, the Grand Crusade Memorial. Belongs to an airspace that was conquered by the squadron Red and I were in. It's where she wanted to retire. At the time, there was an accident that involved a botanical trading vessel. The accident had nothing to do with her. But from that day on, Red would keep telling me that she wanted to start a flower business after she retires. Said she wanted to grow lumen plants. I thought she was crazy. But it worked out for her, didn't it? It's some effort. It took her years to cultivate them. Yeah. Traveling thousands of light years to another solar system. Just to find a planet with the right conditions. She even asked me to take an extended leave so I could survey the soil with her. Yeah. Do you ever miss her? This is such a sundry answer. No, I don't care about them. Why would I care? Huh. No, I couldn't care less about someone who comes and goes without a word. And shows up asking me to look after her daughter. Master used to talk about you all the time. I never miss her. Sure, sure, sure. She also told me to give you this, if you ever board the ship again. Bastard. Obtained Red's picture. Oh. There's flowers in the back, right? Right? That's right, flowers. 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 On the back of the photo were a few words to the doctor, written by Red. The flowers have bloomed, so hang this over your operating table, will you? For my friend Dr. Russell, I miss our days of flight. Oh! Glory to the United! May fire and iron light the stars! in memory of our fallen heroes. The doctor sneered at the name, saying what the memorial represented was anything but grand. She never forgot the day that she and Red were to shoot down a Zhao Geish civilian ship. Oh my god, those are civilians? Fire harder! <laughs> the walls inside the tower were engraved with accounts of the war, primarily focused on how United Mining turned the war in its favor. There wasn't much recorded about the witches, even going so far as to say they were the cause of the chaos. Public defacement like this not only threatened the lives of witches, but it also left them tormented by guilt, as could be seen in Ada's master. I mean, history's written by the winners, so... United Mining won, so... I 
their version of history becomes the truth, right? Totally. The 16th Witch Detection Squad mistakenly shot down a civilian vessel, which led to, or which lead to, led to, wait, led, 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 led to a large, led, 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 F12 was the wrong lead. Should be LED. Which led to large scale conflict with Zhao Gay. Or is it Hey? It's probably not pronounced like neither. It's probably like Shay or some shit. I don't know. They even went so far as to identify our squad. How nice of them to leave out our names. What a shame, Ada. It seems the names of us sinners have been left out of this historic memorial. Doctor, it wasn't your fault. Eddie, how about I use my wrench to do a number on this wall? <laughs> Should we let Remy j deface the monument? Take care of this ourselves? Shot down a civilian ship, it says. Yeah, eh, I should have said that. Wait, does, this one doesn't say... This one, the memorial doesn't say they shot down a civilian ship. That's what the doctors say. You know, if it was written down here, it would say something like they shot down a military vessel or something. They wouldn't say they shot down a civilian ship. Let's sweep that under the rug. So we'll all take care of this ourselves. After speaking, Ada disappeared for a period of time. When she got back to the ship, she whispered, She's not a killer. She's my master. Ada may have looked calm on the outside, but I quickly found out that if something upset her, she would get really aggressive. Ada's grand graffiti. Oh, she just... Ah, oh, okay. Ah, don't hit it with a wrench. Let me, let me vandalize it with some spray paint first. All right. You did, did read it? Oh, okay. I have no idea how Ada avoided all the security cameras. Before leaving, she sprayed the flower that symbolized her master. What hurt her the most wasn't the pain and suffering caused by United Mining, but the fact that they took her master away and did not give her the honor she deserved. Her master may have been res responsible for the loss of many lives, but she did save Ada. <laughs> New message! Do I read botanical services plan renewal complete? Red Chamber crew, your lumen plant tending service for the following property expires today. United Mining Sector 2, New I read area 692, number 301, collective plantation, the Red Witch's Hut, registered person, Red Grant. Oh, that's her, the, her, her house or something, right? We have automatically renewed your plan. If you wish to terminate the service, please notify us within seven days. We wish you a pleasant journey among Thousand Peaks. Come join New Iran, developed uh, by United Mining. It's the friendliest immigration sector of the Galactic Empire. Oh, if you say so. I, I, I would never. A civilian signal. Interesting. Ooh, what's this? Oh, come on! It's like right on the line! It's like right there! How's that ha You're ridiculous. <laughs> this really ship what I don't understand. They were totally evil, okay? Mount Aurora Cave, Southern Peak. This plant was repaired in 8533, and turbine, turbine maintenance is set to begin in 8535 to ensure plant safety. Basic lumium usage conforms with the Lumen Mining Act and is verified by United Mining. Signal source, Aurora K Freedom Corporation. Let's go! This place, uh, I'm sure, uh, it's very friendly. Ah! What the heck? The Traveler of Thousand Peaks visited over 50 locations in Thousand Peaks. Stop. Don't give me a heart attack there. I was like, what the fuck? Why is that so much louder than the game? They're, try they're trying to get your attention. They're like, bam! 
Jabe. This cave is the pride of the Lumen Mining Act. It's the first step in reclaiming Lumium refinement capabilities for Thousand Peaks. I remember how the doctor smiled when we brought this place up. Something she rarely did. And unlike United Mining, we'll preserve it. Not Aurora Cave, Southern Peak. Let's go. Inside the nearly completed mining facilities, the, a shrine overflowing with Lumen was separated off with glass. Murals and natural formations were both assiduously preserved. The construction was, unit was working hard to share the space fairly with the gods. Coming from East Ocean, it made me feel ashamed. After all, the excessive industrialization back home made even lumen plants hard to come by. Crappers, can't find Eddie. Did she head off to look for intel? Hey, why is June gone too? <gasps> they left to go off have a moment, okay? Ah, young lady, I've confirmed your vessel ID number. You're the technician for the Red Chamber crew, right? I'm with the Daily Lumen, and lots of young people are dying to hear your story. Uh-uh. There's a witch and a young runner in your crew, if I'm not mistaken. Are they a couple? Is there any chance I could interview them? A relationship between a witch and a runner? That's a real hot topic. If you get me in touch, I'll pay you with some decent intel. I can get in touch with the captain. The guy's just a servant. That sounds like Remy. Couple relationship! Get the hell out of here! She's like, no way, man. No way. I'm so quiet, but she even goes... Oh, well, let's see if we're lucky. We can actually fail this one, so... When I met back up with the crew, Ada was doing an interview with a reporter. The Daily Lumen apparently wanted to do some special report on us. Thank you so much. This wonderful story of yours will certainly touch the hearts of Mount Aurora's youth. Oh, we got Lumen entire, huh? Servant? Yeah, we're just the servant around here, you know. Lumen intel that came from the Daily Lumen. No one knew what kind of cave we'd find. New messages. Daily Lumen Red Chamber interview draft. Ooh. I'm looking for my master. She's a great witch. The first time I met Captain Ada of the Red Chamber, she didn't hide the fact that she was a witch. I know the peakers hate us, but runners just need to trust in themselves and do a good job. Ada has a petite stature, but she speaks resolutely. It feels as if her eyes can see right through your soul. Who would, have just th who would have thought that this was the crew leader who discovered the largest Mirian ruin in the last two years and was given the Honorable Runner's Award? Following Ada was her attendant who served as both pilot and technician. Earnest and welcoming, she spoke with confidence in front of the witch. The other crewman was an East Oceaner mercenary. I'm a mercenary now? Imagine getting interviewed and paid. Insanity, right? According to the technician, they'd rescued him from the clutches of some pirates. From then on, he'd become their servant. Please ignore what Remy said during the interview. June is not a slave. <laughs> okay. P.S. We'll adjust the witch part a little. The Daily Lumen reporter, Horden. Feel free to get in touch anytime. Right. And the Seekers Red Chamber crew interview. The Daily Lumen's interview with Red Chamber. You must believe in yourself. Before searching for Lumen, first search your soul. In the end, you will find the Lumen that you're looking for. That's Ada. She has a petite stature, but she speaks resolutely. It feels as if her eyes can see right through your soul. 
Who would have thought that this was the crew leader who discovered the largest mirroring ruins in the last two years and was given the Honorable Runner's Award? Following her was a girl who worked as both the pilot and technician. The other member of the crew was a young East Oceaner mercenary and runner. This tiny crew's meteoric rise has made them the idols for the younger generation of Aurora. Lumen of the Peaks, flow without end. The Daily Lumen is your unbiased news source of the peaks and is committed to upholding standards of objectivity and neutrality. Ooh, that one's much nicer. What are those coordinates? They're going to be way off in fuck-off land. Uh, maybe not. Maybe not way off in fuck-off land. Can I actually go over there now? No, it still says can't scan that. No, we still can't go over there yet. We're right here, right? No, we're right there. I guess we'll go over here. Free City, Mount Aurora. Resupply facilities! Lumen Association Regulation Article 10. On composition, the Lumen Association is composed of different races, different religions, and different alliances. Yet we are all the same, for we are all united under the name Thousand Peaks. first version was the hotter topic. It was. You can't just call people slaves, though. Come on. What do you think of June, Remy? Well, that's a question. We already know what Remy thinks. He sucks. An obedient pet. Huh? Just an oceaner. Our ship is off course by 15 degrees. What I meant was... Adjusted to three degrees. Please confirm the plotted course, Captain. She's like, I don't want to talk about this. He's been talking about his clan a lot lately. I don't understand why he's so serious about it. Cool. Damn. Benzel asked me out the other day. Really? I said no, because I think they're all liars. You think so? Have you ever hated someone from the bottom of your heart? United Mining? I hate June. A lot. Oof. I know. He can be frustrating sometimes. It's like, no, you don't understand why, why, why I hate him. No wonder I hate him so much. In different races, they mean humans and capybaras. Maybe we have other talking animals around here somewhere. You never know. I was when I saw the capybara, I was like, oh man, there's going to be a bunch of talking animals. But that's been like the only one. Who knows? Who knows? Headquarters for the Lumen Association. From what I remember, this was a massive city that embodied the spirit of Thousand Peaks. It looks pretty big. Let's check out the hospital. Repurposed from a hospital during the war, Mount Aurora Municipal Hospital is the largest medical institute in Thousand Peaks. The lobby was packed with people from all over the land seeking treatment. Long lines of scavengers and runners that were injured in caves could be seen waiting to be called as they shared stories of their adventures with one another. Patient 425 has gone missing again. It's James. That bastard in his adventures. Next time, tie him to the damn bed. James? I think I've seen that name in the Lumen Association's Hall of Fame. James Wong, a cave runner who loves leaving behind recordings of himself after he explores a cave. He's famous, all right. A famous nut job. Well, we don't have the recorder. We can't do that. I have no idea where he's at. Let's go. Since we had no clues concerning his disappearance, we slipped away. Hmm. You'll find him sometime. Thousand Peaks Civil College. Located in the free neutral city of Mount Aurora, Thousand Peaks Civil College was the only college in the peaks. Here, a select few gathered for academic research regarding the reconstruction of Thousand Peaks and the miracles of Lumen. The institution would regularly send out excavation parties. 
and their presence could be found in caves far and wide. And that is why we believe the luminous civilization is so distantly removed from our human ancestors. And next, I have received some wonderful news. We are very, very lucky to have some important guests here at the college. Everyone present, I'm sure you've heard of the Red Chamber crew. Red Chamber? Professor, how'd you get them? We've got so many questions. She's like, why, why did I sign up for this? We told them we were just coming to look for intel, but the school, snool, school, 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 the tongue twister, but the school snuck this in. What are we going to do? <laughs> hmm, I don't care. Things whatever. Whatever, let's get this over with. Ada was a bit embarrassed sitting in on the conference. The discussion on the origins of Lumen continued for several hours. She was a bit annoyed at the whole thing, but she was lively and spoke with confidence. I still remember how vividly engaged she was. Or they obtained the origins of Miria conference notes. Wow, we got conference notes. We're so cool. Excerpts from this conference indicate that the Myrian gods who existed in ancient times may have been higher dimensional conscious beings that were formed by a mixture of lumen and other minerals. It is surmised that they used some form of song to activate their internal lumen in order to survive. Without song, they would most likely turn back into their mineral form, and their consciousness would return to the flow of lumen, dispersed among the void. Cool. James, yeah, where'd this guy go? He's somewhere. Distribution center? Barrel after barrel marked with the label United Mining Thousand Peaks were filled with lumium and loaded up on large cargo ships to be sent to the far reaches of Thousand Peaks. Under the supervision of the Mount Aurora Distribution Center, an endless stream of ships and people slowly but surely repaired the scars of war. Red Chamber? A trading vessel? So pleased that you've come here. There's been a huge increase in the number of runners, and our logistics has reached match, max capacity. We need to better understand the needs of traders. How about doing some consulting for us? We could pay you well. Traders? I do have several years of experience selling plants with my master. This one's, this one's kind of 50-50. Well, I'll try it, but it's like... A coin toss here. Difficulty 7. Ada spent an entire day discussing Thousand Peaks trade routes with the director of the Logistics Center. The topics ranged from improving the current business model to how to enter the black market. Perhaps Ada was too idealistic. The director didn't think there was much they'd be able to implement. Rip. I still got a bunch of credits for it, though. Oh, I can try again. Try again! We'll try again till we win. If she wasn't so determined to find her master, she'd be an excellent businesswoman. We won! Well, we got a thousand? Jeez. Did I just, like... Wait. This one's... This one moved it up toward the top. They're trying to trick me. They uh, sw uh, switched the places of these. See if I'm paying attention. Give me the free money. Give me the free money! Oh, this is different. I don't think I can get any more free money. With a number of mines under your name, after your applications go through, I'm sure you'll be able to buy this place. We're doing pretty good right now. I don't think we need to take on any work. Best focus on bi finding Banshee. Dang it. Money! Money, 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 money! Look at all the money I got now. Lumen of the Peaks. Flow without end. The Mirian Shrine located next to the Lumen Association was not built for worshipping Ignis, nor the two gods, Helios and Terra, but for worshipping the ten planetary gods of Thousand Peaks. 
They symbolize the diversity of the Lumen Association and the people that come from every part of the solar system. Stop it, it's throat big at work. What the money? To commemorate the sixth anniversary of the end of the Lumen War, the troupe performing Melody of Star Song will be holding a disaster relief charity benefit. Today's performance is the second act, Songless Heaven, Songless Earth. This will be their fourth performance from the Thousand Peaks tour. Melody of Star Song! This must be the next part of the story! Come on, hurry and sit down, or all the seats are going to get taken! Ah, okay. I'm sitting, but I don't know what's so great about this opera. It's that opera that Ada was really into. What? Dude, the first option is this dude is the dumbest, densest motherfucker on the planet. Obviously, we have to sit next to her. Like, duh. We can be dense as fuck next player, right? Remy wasn't too happy when I sat next to Ada. I bet she wasn't. Get the fuck over it. But the captivating plot soon drew her attention away. Ada was even more focused on the stage and was visibly affected when Tara spoke those tragic lines. Did Melody of Star Song Act 2. Wow! Wow! In the second act, Tara's song created an everlasting flow of lumen granting the Sanctum's immortality. This violated the laws of Ignis, and in fear of divine retribution, six gods rebelled, sacrificing Terra to Ignis and sparking the Holy War. <gasps> so rude. After the performance ended, I heard Ada murmuring the final words Terra spoke to Helios before she was killed. Should we find each other in the next life, let us live on a planet of our own. I will plant flowers among the valleys and sing for you into old age and death. Dang. Those are some fancy final last words. To be honest, I remember my time with Ada more than the details of the story. I bet you do. I bet you do. Hmm. The Council of Ten, located at the Association's headquarters, was composed of the earliest members of the Lumen Association, and was the highest level of decision-making. It was through their efforts that the mining disputes at Thousand Peaks were settled. They fought tirelessly for the rights and interests of the runners, making them a well-respected organization among the people. You sure took your time. God damn it, I want to read all the things! Stop! Oh, oh, there, there you called me Slowpoke. The Council of Ten has requested that no more than two of you be present. Who's going to stay, Ada? I'll let Remy stay then. Since June is the runner, he should come with me. I'm fine either way. Follow me. You are about to meet the highest ranks in the Lumen Association. So don't speak unless I tell you to. Look at you finding all these collectibles. So proud. You know I'll have missed like 50 of them by the end of the first playthrough, right? You'll f you'll, you, get, you get a good chunk just playing through the game. The uh, ones that you could miss, uh, I'll have found like maybe half of them. Come on now. Greetings. Unfortunately, the most council members are quite busy today. So there's only the three of us. Is this the Red Chamber Vessel crew? They're quite young. And that is the human radar? The witch? He's like, ugh. How is a witch allowed to fly so freely on a United Mining Radar Vessel? This is practically a war crime. Ada had nothing to do with the war. Don't talk to her like, dude, you were told to not fucking talk. Tell him to shut up. 
quiet June. I was once a witch as well, Vice President. Do I need to remind you that such language violates association policy? Ooh. But why are you choosing these children? They've made quite a name for themselves, even outside of Thousand Peaks. They received the Honorable Runner's Award and even saved an immigration convoy. You have nothing to complain about. Fine, get on with it then. Then let us move on to the main subject. Close the doors. Ugh. You know the serious business starts when the voice acting comes back. Have we said this before? Well, any of me if I don't find every single one? You know I've already missed them. I've said no a few times to things. I bet those had ones. Probably never get over it, but it is what it is. You'll, you'll, you'll get over it. You'll be fine. さらに公的な私たちは彼らより先に流脈最新部の環境流名を入手したいのです。議論はそこまであなたの考えを教えてくださいエイダ私はすいません皆さんは厚労センターに高齢の流脈に侵入しろと言ってるんですね我々が危険を犯す必要性を教えてください国流調査団の名はご存知<笑> ゼロ三三二三協力者によれば任務目標は黒竜だそうよ。悪いけどあなたのことを調べさせてもらったわ。厚労の巫女。あなたの市長さんが本当に黒竜にいるなら、高齢より先に入らないとでしょ。この案件はとても<笑> You'll still be disappointed, maybe wonder why you watch me. It's for my amazing proneness, of course. Two, uh, 20 of 298 collectibles so far. I have 240 collectibles to get in this game. We're at like 118 or something, I forgot. Support my what? My amazing proneness! I'm super pro, after all. Which means I'm a derp, right? What's a pronus? Super derpy, right? I, I get trophies and achievements while being a derp sometimes. It's, it's very entertaining. Got a merchant, huh? Lumen of the Peaks. Flow without end. This is a licensed operation under the Lumen Mining Act. What can I do for you, runner? No. Limit reached. Oh, okay. 
Most beam focuser. I wonder if I can find those. I've already got some in possession. Hmm. I wonder if I need that for upgrades, but maybe I can find that if from exploring. Let's say these two are unique, so I should get these. Yeah. You show you? You're watching right now. Oh, we're at 113. Okay. This is part one. Scripture, Splitting in the Ten Peaks, part one. Authored by the Lumen Association, based on archaeological data from Marian ruins. This text describes the late stages of the Marian Empire, when Helios called upon Terra to sing for Maria's continued prosperity. Ignis was enraged by this, and he warned the gods that the wrath of heaven would befall them if they did not stop. Helios defied Ignis, however, and was dragged into war with the gods who took Ignis's side. Yikes. Ours must present their Lumen Association. I guess we'll buy that. Official Lumen Intel sold by the Lumen Association. Without an excavation permit, it was difficult to purchase. It's probably isn't in the game to exhibit one's Protus. You think so? Yes. Oh. Hmm. I wonder if I need a pulse beam focuser for an upgrade. Oh, I broke again. There goes all that money I made. I don't have much. I do have the 50% though, so I could actually sell these now, because I don't have a better upgrade for these. If I needed to. I'll send you the information later. I want you to know, I would rather you not be involved. You're dealing with Banshee, not just any cave. I can't allow myself to help you any further. You've done more than enough for us, Doctor. I really do wish you could find Red. But I also want you to live your own life. I know. You take care. I have some unfinished business here in Mount Aurora. And take this with you. You're a member of the Inner Circle now. Obtain Six Peaks Ring? Wow! We got a fancy ring! A fancy ring! Wow! We're super cool now. We're very fancy now. A doctor gave this to us before we left Aurora. On the ring was a carving of the six planets that had disappeared long ago. They symbolized the six peaks that revolted against Helios during the Holy War. This ring was used by those in the Lumen Association carrying out secret orders. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't look like I need a focus navigator thing for... Was it for one of the other ones, maybe? I don't think I need to buy that beam thing anyway. I don't need it for the rest of the upgrades. Unless it's this. But, who knows? It's okay, you're used to being disappointed. Oh. Well, I'm getting ready to disappoint you further then, right? That's the same dialogue. We got new messages! Warning excavation conflicts. 
Recently, distrust reports for runner ships have been on the rise. Reliable sources indicate that ever since the Red Chamber discovered the ancient Mirian remains known as the Lumen Ziggurat, Ironwind military activity has continued to rise. We advise runners to not go near military bases or cave airspace that belong to Ironwind. The Lumen Association fully complies with the Lumen Mining Act and is the only organization in Thousand Peaks that can legally register civilian caves. This one's marked as important. Oh god, Benzel needs to fuck off. Uh, she's not interested. She, she, she's not interested in you, man. I know a pretty good restaurant! Eddie wants to run off with that guy. This is just too much. Endless Lumen. I can't describe how much this hurts that my romantic rival is about to leave. I've lost my purpose. But it'll be okay, Remy. Let me console you. Even though you responded to my date proposal six months late, I know you didn't mean it. Broken-hearted, Benzel. Fuck you. Yes, that restaurant I mentioned appears to have gone out of business. How about this one? PPS. Can we pay separately? Broke, bitch. Um, uh, or Orkai's Ironwind's Luxury Supper Club. That looks way too expensive for my blood, man. Do you think I like? Do you think I have any fucking money? I like spend it all on my fuel and shit. Like, only your true love would take you there. Peaks Top 100 gave it 4.5 stars. No menu, a private wine collection, and a suite with a view that gazed beyond the galaxy. It was more than just delicious dishes. It was an unforgettable experience with a loved one. Even that was still, it was ridiculously expensive. Orkai's was still one of the most popular date locations for peaker couples. It's for the reputation, man. You can say, I've been there. I had food there. Aren't I cool? Aren't I awesome? I don't believe you've ever done anything that made me think wow positively. Ouch. Ouch. Uh, that stings, man. Stings. Association secret mission briefing. Briefing, huh? Dear Ada, you'll have to go into United Mining airspace for this mission. Since you aren't an Ironwind citizen, they won't be easy on you. If you encroach on military airspace, they might even shoot you down. Even if Remy can evade United Mining Spaceways, I suggest you get upgrade Red Chamber Signal Modifier. Take care of yourself. Don't do anything that would make Red sad. I'm getting some key directions. United Mining Top Secret Mission! The doctor would always say, maintaining a good relationship with United Mining to help runners is the association's main focus. So that is our next mission. We're going to infiltrate United Mining airspace. I hope you two understand the risk involved. Yes, Ada. Any questions, Remy? Remy? No big deal. I'll forge a visa and upgrade Red Chamber signal modifier. We still need to watch out, though. Even if we do avoid radar detection with modified signals. If we don't time our stay and run into them head on, we'll be dead. Understood. Is there any way we can stay out of sight? We should be able to avoid their patrol shifts. June, do you understand the risks? I trust in Remy's calculations. He's like, damn it. Stop saying things like that. Remy? I can handle it. Hmm. This is all June's fault. I can't handle this. How are we going to sneak into United Mining's caves? I don't know. How are we? Whoa. Question marks. If you want to ban me now, go ahead. I deserve it. All right, all right, all right. You see here, young man. I'm very profile. I'm very cool. I'm very awesome. 
you just have to um, deal with it, I guess. And, um... Bop! There. Understand? Good. Okay, I sure showed you. Kapow, kapow! Anyway, I'm gonna further disappoint you because I'm gonna go on snack break now. Oh, wait for a snack break! Ah! We're gonna do snackle break. Oh, yeah, we got coordinates too, don't we? Oh, yeah, the Lumen Intel. Oh, wait, that's the one we already marked. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, these other ones. The top secret mission is way over there. How about this one? Where are all these bitches? Wait, this is the, that other one. Where oh, the fucking hell are those around? It's, yeah. Man, if I want to explore those before the top secret mission, I gotta go all over the place. Don't worry, we got this. The game seems fairly good at making sure you don't run out of fuel. Uh, but, but first, uh, snacky break time, okay? First, it's snackle break. Oh, wow, you retract everything? Oh, <gasps> you do? Woo! All right, all right. Uh, I'm gonna go have my food now. Uh, 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 you, you guys hang out. Maybe get yourself some tasty food too. That's right, tasty. It's time for tasty. Be out of me. All right, let's go exploring. Pizza, less pizza. Ha! Hmm. I haven't been here yet. Let's explore the stuff around here first, and then we'll decide if we want to go to uh, those intel places. I think we probably will go to the side places first. Hmm. Illiterati uh, Academy Oceana. Through the deepest valleys we have traveled, seeking light at the end of the cave. Forget the sorrows of war and help these lost children find a home. If visitors would like a meeting, please register at Ads Blocked. An orphanage, huh? That's disgusting. What? Barbecue pizza is amazing. It's okay, actually. I prefer barbecue separately with, like, uh, chicken. Barbecue sauce is for, um, chicken nuggets, okay? That was pretty good with, like, ribs and stuff, too, so. I know. Just playing by use usual. Phew. I'm sure you, you have something weird, too. You, got, you probably have some food that's perfectly normal where you are, and I'd be like, what? On this tiny space station, many Thousand Peaks orphans completed their only formal education. Oh, yep. I can't imagine it being the best education. Probably something about how United Mining is amazing. The best. The only weird I see is you. I'm weird? What? God damn it. Hmm. Founded many years ago, when the orphanage took in many children from the Aurora region who were abandoned during the war. Some of the orphans were from Zhao Ge or the Rumani clan, while some of the older ones were even exiled witches. Though the dean rarely showed his face, everyone said his hope was that one day the discrimination would end. He was a gentle but determined man that hoped to create a future for Thousand Peaks. It sounds nice. Well, well. <coughs> oh, I'm trying to I'm trying to choke on my food now. Well, well, the witch of the red chamber. What brings you here? Isn't your mission more important? Hmm. Since the children are here, I won't say anymore. We are holding a class on Miria. Would you like to share your thoughts with the kids? Surely your wealth of experience with Lumen gives you a unique perspective on it. Hmm. 
Oh, is that the same guy we saw before? Isn't he the vice president for the Council of Ten? What's he do doing working as the dean? I never thought he'd be doing something like this. I guess I was wrong about him. These children are all orphans of the war. I'm a witch. Are they even going to be able to accept me? Always believe what your teachers tell you. Tell them the truth. I have a feeling we'll get in trouble if we speak the truth, but... Yeah, I'm a rebel! Let's do it! Okay, so for the first class, we'll start by planting flowers. The vice president and the children didn't know what to make of that. Sometimes I forgot she had left the tower's teachings behind. To this day, I still remember what she taught the students. Obtained Ada's class notes. Wow! I'm the weirdest. Excuse me? You see here, I'm awesome! Not weird. Well, actually, I am weird. Never mind. You're right, you're right, you're right. Well, if I'm weird, so are you. So, there. Miria, never lasting. Serve none but the flower within, she said. The soul takes the form of a flower. Look not beyond yourselves, but tend to its every need. When the class was over, Ada gave all the children a bag of seeds. Cool. Awesomely weird. That's goddamn right. But can I even go here? That's where the planet is, right? South Mount Aurora. Mining vessels currently in orbit. Please follow the instructions provided by United Mining to safely pass through the asteroid belt. Cool, let's go. Let's go maybe die. It's Saturn, I mean, South Mount Aurora. One of Thousand Peaks' four largest planets. Its abundant resources supply both the citizens and the military. Cool. There's nothing for me to do here, though. A civilian signal. A daily lumen. Oh, it's the news place. Newsflash. Amendment 3 of the Lumen Mining Act has entered the Iron Wind Council, emphasizing the importance of protecting the environment. Newsflash. Amendment 3 of the Lumen System has blocked repairing messages. Let's go. Awesomely weird. Yeah! Eddie, we're getting a signal from the ship saying they're a special correspondent from the daily lumen. Why is the signal quality... Why is the signal quality is so bad? F12. Why is the signal quality so bad? I'm gonna open the channels. Is this the re re red chamber? I'm from the Daily Lumen. We've got our ha hands on some Im important intel. But we've got to contact the association I immediately. But our sh ship's long-range communication module is having issues. Can you help us send it? <laughs> hmm. Does Doc and our technician will help you repair your comm system and use our ship as a relay station? No problem. How are you weird? Well, um, that's just a captainly quality. So, so there. Let's see if we can fail the roll. Well, I guess we didn't fail the roll. The Red Chamber was able to send over the message immediately. To thank us for helping out, the correspondent gave us one of her valuable leads, which turned out to be some Lumen Intel. Dang. Haven't we gotten this before? Oh, they're per different caves each time. They're called the same thing, though. Um, I'm in trouble. So I'm interested in make sure I get all the different ones that got the same thing. You cry in your bucket. That's a very 
weird thing to do. Who cries in a bucket? To cry over, uh, I don't know. Uh, I guess a bucket's fine, then. Lumen intel that came from the Daily Lumen. No one knew what kind of cave we'd find. I gave you the bucket? Dang it. That's true. That's a weird thing to do. Dang it! I've been called out now. You only care about caves, not Banshee. Remy would always pick on me when I was reading the Daily Lumen. Hmm. Despite its unremarkable exterior, the office was wall to wall with circulating leads and intel. The shouts of editors and reporters coming and going could be heard in waves. Every runner in Thousand Peaks was relying on the information being exchanged here. Ooh. It's an honor to be graced with the presence of such great members of the association. I would love to interview you, but I'm simply too busy. United Mining is trying to amend the Lumen Mining Act. We're planning on publishing a special edition, hoping that public opinion will make them back down. Unfortunately, we don't have enough people to get it done. Eddie, we can't give up a chance to catch United Mining with their pants down. I know there's no intel involved, but these people need help, Ada. Wow, can't believe they agree. But are they going to be able to work together? Well, since they, they actually agree... Oh, I can't just say no, I have to do it. It's just whether it's just June and Ada or everybody. I mean, they both agree to do it, so I think they actually could get along for five seconds. We're going to eat both of them. I had a few questions when we were organizing the information about the Lumen Mining Act, and each time Remy would shout in my face. Most of our time was spent arguing. Oops. Ada got fed up with us and politely told them we were unable to help. Whoops. Dang it! It failed. I thought they could get along because they both wanted to do it. I really can't stop fighting for like two seconds. Hey, Bokage, what's up? What's happening? How's it going? Hi, yo, to you too. Hope you're doing well. Well, it's from Daily Lumen. Civilians oppose a United Mining plan to amend the Lumen Mining Act. This is probably like a draft they're sending me. Or maybe the official article. Who knows? Well, Daily Lumen reporting from Ironwind. Concerning the first proposed amendment to the Lumen Mining Act. Reliable sources indicate that there's a high probability the tax on exporting raw lumen will increase. The Lumen Association has emphasized that this amendment will most likely break the long-standing trust between civilians and iron wind. The Lumen Mining Act is a special law that was formulated by Uniting Mining after the war. The Lumen Association was commissioned to advance this law, which stipulates that besides officially registered caves, all individuals must do to legally obtain unrestricted mining rights is to register with United Mining and pay a tax of 10% on all profits resulting from cave-related investments. The Daily Lumen is your unbiased news source of the peaks and is committed to upholding its standards of objectivity and neutrality. Whoa. Hmm. What are those new coordinates we got? Closer. Now well, let's see what's here. Thousand Peaks Culture Foundation? Thanks to our biggest donor this year, James Wong. Lumen of the peaks flow without end. May the fires of Mirian civilization burn brighter by the day. This foundation was set up by the Rodine family. Ah, it's blocked! Too many ads. I'm glad they have space ad blockers. So what if I came back a little late? It's for Melody of Star Song. I had to go out and do research. Get inspired. If you don't turn on your communication channel, I'm going to spill all the family secrets. You just watch me. What the hell am I stumbling into? One of the Rodian ships is hogging the public channel. They're going on about family stuff. Let them deal with it. Let's just hack in and turn it off. Every family has its problems. We should help them out. 
Let's pretend to be part of the family. Let them get in touch. Let them deal with their own problems. Difficulty A. Oof. There's a good chance I could fail this one. Let's go fail it. The one online was Felis Roding, the creator of Melody of Star Song. Is that the thing I've seen like Act 1 and Act 2 of? He spent so much time working on the opera that he rarely went home and his family nearly kicked him out. Damn. Red Chamber was able to get him in touch with his family and help resolve the issue. Ooh, we barely succeeded. Roding family brooch. Wow! Wow! We got a cool thing! An expression of friendship and gratitude, the brooch emitted an ice blue aura and was made of highly refined lumen metal. Holding it in my hands, I could feel it resonating. You'll need this one day, Rodin said as he gave this to us. I will. The first time we came here, I thought we'd discovered a cave. All I got was Remy silently reminding how stupid she thought I was. Dang it. The Roding family, founders of the Thousand Peaks Culture Foundation, were the very first to discover Lumen in Thousand Peaks. They developed their wealth through the sale of mining rights and became a famous family of adventurers. They extended across the whole, thousand, the whole of Thousand Peaks with the mission to promote and preserve the Mirian culture. The famous opera, Melody of Star Song, was created for this purpose, and was one of the most popular pieces among peakers. Well, there's no dialogue here or anything? Besides that, no extra dialogue? Uh, well... I guess I'm going this way. It's the only way to go. To work my way out of here. Processing plant Luma Caverna. All water flows to the sea, but how it's used depends on thee. Luma Caverna provides military grade fuel and armor coating materials. Wow! I should be able to get infinite fuel here then, right? Let's go. Oh. Time for my armor plates to take a beating. Warning a large amount of debris has been detected in the spaceway. Objects identified 43. 56, 162, 3,874. Number is increasing rapidly. Anti-collision system has been activated. Top speed constraints are in place. Eddie! Some ships heading towards the processing plant say a container fell into the spaceway. And now synth scepter parts are a little all over the place. Uh-oh. There's way too many ships trying to dock. It'll probably take a while to clean up. Should we just go around them? Maybe I could help? I could do some scavenging. Totally! Throwing you out into the spaceway to collect thousands of scraps sounds great! Um. She's so sarcastic. So sarcastic! She's so borderline root. Hmm. You can't help everybody. Let's just get out of orbit. Uh oh. We still had quite the journey ahead of us, so we calculated a new route that avoided the chaotic orbit. Later on, we heard that more than a few collisions occurred. I hope there weren't any casualties. Uh-oh, we got people murderized. Well, not really murdered, but... Killed! Maybe. We're villains, man. Villains. I remember Remy telling me to get rid of my old synth scepter. I knew she was doing it on purpose, and we got into a big argument about it. Uh-oh. Although this place was not nearly as massive as United Mining's military bases, it was still the largest factory that served runners in Thousand Peaks. Commonly seen synth scepters, as well as most scavenging equipment used by the runners, were all developed here. Red Chamber, will you be docking here? That's wonderful! It just so happens that we're looking for runners to help us tune these newly developed synth scepters. 
You've got an experienced East Ocean runner aboard, don't you? Could he come help us test them out? The Peekers are finally starting to accept me. Ada, I'd love to go help. <laughs> I'm not sure how good he is, but boy, does he know how to cause trouble. If you don't want your data to get screwed up, you should probably find someone else. But it's up to you. Well, you two cut it out. I'll decide. Bam. I mean, June's guaranteed to succeed because of the luck. So. I can't let myself be bullied by Remy. The synth scepters made by Luma Caverna were different than those from, produced for the East Ocean. It took a bit more time to tune them, but the results were good. Now oh, I got 300 bucks. You guys got any more money for me? God damn it. I helped you out and you only gave me 300 bucks. I demand like a bajillion dollars. Obviously. What's over here? Opus News Agency. Newsflash, the new season of Opus's astronomical journey will soon be ad blocked. Hmm. So the chance of me getting fuel is decreasing, huh? I made, uh, by... Y'all only live once. Let's go. The worst that happens is we, um, get stranded and have to get rescued, right? The host of this network was super famous, but nobody had a clue what they looked like. On the surface, the agency looks like an enormous observation spacecraft equipped with advanced technology. However, we searched the entire site and did not find a single employee. Robots! This is staffed by robots. Hello, Ameth is looking for Earth. Is there a planet called Earth here? An autonomous robot? Is the technology in Thousand Peaks really this sophisticated? You there. Tell Emmeth the name of the planet that's third closest to the sun. The... Uh, the uh, uh, this one? That's a gas planet, not Earth. It looks like the terrestrial planets of this solar system disappeared long ago. The robot was clearly upset, but he perked up to thank us. Ending us a little model as he said, Here, this is for you. Obtained Emmeth's rocket. Okay. Wow! He gave us a rocket! A rocket! But not a rocket. Punch! Just a rocket. A tiny little rocket. Emmeth said that on this journey, on his journey, a young man and woman had given it to him. On the bottom were a few words. Heavenly Earth, thanks to all the players for your continued support. Sigoto Manufacturing. Okay. Oh, what? A, A, A. Rocket Punch! Pow! Rocket Punch! Wait, wait, wait. Rocket Punch! I'll try to go higher. Well, you go so high. Can only go so high, man. Do my best. Careful, hearts. I certainly have been. Ah, that's sweet. And for the speedrun version. Resigned Witch's Star Song, huh? What are we resigned to? A witch's imitation of the Star Song from deep within an asteroid, revealing a facet of the lumen it holds. Nico, 
This cable definitely have fuel, maybe. Wait, what? Oh, I can't go there unless I can uh, analyze it better. What? Uh, I might actually be in trouble. It's a military base. I don't have the forged BZ yet, right? Hmm. Wow. So this nearest place with supplies is too far away. Wow. Looks like I actually will run out of fuel. I guess we'll see what happens. Hmm. <sighs> A few options on where to go. Maybe they have fuel. Let's go lose. I mean, we already have nowhere to go. Alright, it's all my fault. Alright. Alright, we're doomed. Give us fuel, please. Nope. We're out of fuel. Rest in peace. Well, I mean, we're going over here. Mount Aurora Cave, West Mount Tonitras. Construction area. Those without a Lumen Association permit are restricted from entry. Project name Lumen Cave Development Project Phase 1. Supervisor United Mining Corporation. Contractor Aurora Cave Freedom Corporation. Don't have a few to go that far. If we run out, we might end up drifting in the middle of nowhere. You already have? I made... Everybody's supposed... You can't refuel anywhere. If we upgrade to a hybrid Lumium engine t too, we'll be able to go further for sure. But, uh... Let's just go and hope for the best. Let's go, let's go lose. Excuse me. Are we drifting off course? Aren't we going to make it, Remy? I warned you guys! We didn't have enough fuel! All we can do now is find some place to orbit. And wait for rescue. You're notifying the distressed vessel ahead. According to Article 14 of the Thousand Peaks Treaty of Autonomy, you have the right to pay a fee in order to be rescued or to remain drifting in this location. I don't have the for forged VZ yet. Thousand credits? This is literally the only thing I can do. Close this bureaucrat. See if we get lucky. I still remember the response they sent back. Glory to the United Honorable Vessel traveling from afar. We will escort you to a safe location. For a second, I couldn't believe what was happening. Remy, on the other hand, was beaming with confidence. Damn, I destroyed that one. Just back to Mount Aurora, huh? Oh yeah, we haven't found his stuff yet. Give us more money! Ooh, ooh I can get some more money. Let's go! More mana! More mana! Dang it. Oh, 
There goes our replacement fuel. <clears throat> Good thing we were able to, uh, um... Uh, uh, left to go adrift wasn't even an option. I either had to fool them or, uh, uh, pay up. There's a lot of money to pay up, though. If I had a thousand credits, I wouldn't have been drifting. Totally. Hmm... Too far, right? That one was too too tough to analyze. What was that? Spend all that fuel we just bought. Let's go run out of fuel and get rescued again. Wait, what? Oh, they're doing a simulation of how to get in there, right? の手の Oh, we're gonna play as her now. Nothing useful. Will I go down. Shokuryu きゅうけてくれません。愛され承認ダーマ。ポッキョ。け。何度も何度も。既読するだけじゃ足りない。でも、お姉様とあの英会増理虫が駆け落ちしたら、それもありか。関室の常備消火器全部リバカにぶっかけようか。Oh, <laughs> Must have landed his head. I can't aim it though, it's just throwing itself. Come on! You can you can get his head. Come on. You're very good at this aiming thing. Did 
tell you. Maybe if you pick up these darts, it'll work. I'll touch she loves June more and plans to leave with him. That'd be funny. Oh, well, that looks like a potential visa thing. If the cosmos was not what it what brought us together, the cosmos never was. 8531, 621. Experience a post apocalyptic romance with Faye and Jones. <laughs> Emma, the cleaning bot, manufactured by Opus Rocket Factory. A robot without a purpose is no more than a calculator. Let Emmeth bring you the best cleaning experience. That's why he's jumbled up in the... down there. From now on, she is your family. 8529 by Red. The Red Witch's Hut, New Wyron. How do we pronounce it? So, uh, well, they're both connected... Too red, huh? Ah! Oh, that's cute. Time for more Remy backstory. こいつら戦争工事だろ。トゥルワの密輸コンテナを隅かにして何年経ってるんだ。おい。お嬢ちゃんか通報してくれたのは協力ありがとうな。トゥルワ兄は教えてやろう。トゥルワはひどいやつな
As a victim of human trafficking, the place that was supposed to, have recor to record Remy's parents was left blank. She said her full name was Cozy Remy Chocolate, manufactured by the Dorian Corp. Uh, okay. But some soldier had given her chocolates, and she thought the name sounded nice. <laughs> That's cool, Straber. I'm happy for you. Is that so? Is that so? Yes. Oh. Are you sure you believe? Uh, I mean, I was kind of making it up with the whole lighthearted, chill, happy game thing, though. Mm. This looks like a letter thing to me. Oh, where's it here? But I like throwing this dart at him. Ah! I can aim it. I don't think I can press any button to aim it. No, I don't think it does anything. It'd be funny though. これ。これ。前に食べ物と引き換えに作った偽物の資料だ。できたよ。通関用出荷商品伝票。有効期間は3日間だけ。検査官を騙したいなら急いで。大山不当の廃棄船内で生活してる孤児ってお前のことかボス、気をつけてこいつはガキの頃からトゥルワが育てて船に乗せてたんですよ。やつは大戦後に死んだだろ。何を怖がってる。違うんです。トゥロワは裏切られたんです。じゃなきゃ、高齢なんかに捕まりませんぜ。何が言いたい。あの時ガキどもは全員無事だった。つまり、あの中の誰かが。私はトゥロワに酔ってない。なるほどな
Expired military visa. Captain Red Grant. Ship ID. Class. Lumen seeking vessel. Expiration date not available. Expires upon discharge. Valid region. Thousand Peaks. What? So what do I do with this? Put it in the computer, I guess. What happens when I do this? Ah, I was gonna have some fun! There's no fun! Oh, that's not what I thought. Hmm. They're testing. Oh no, they're testing my memory. Oh no, I should have read the read out the numbers and IDs after all. <gasps> I think it was the age. Three, bunch of stuff. これでいけるっしょ。よし。あとは軍籍登録証の番号を通信モジュールにコピーして前に書き換えたのいつだっけ。食べ物。ありがとう。お互い様でしょ。こんな対戦時の骨董品システムに精通してる人はなかなか見つからないから。This is what they bet, huh? If he did, he'd be very disappointed. Likely never forgive me. Whew, thank goodness that won't happen. あ、私たちの船がそんなに魅力的？全然こっち見てくれないのね。あなたたち植物の貿易会社の人。あれは新世代のミコのシンバル。船長が書いたのよ。何者にも属さず自分が嫌いな自分になり、上に書いてあるあの言葉後半読めなくなってる。自分が嫌いな自分になり、魂の
ラミアラミアミコの道はね自分の魂に耳を傾け聞こえたものを歌うことなのそうすればあなたの心の奥の望みが明らかになるわこっち向いて顔を見せてくれるラミアちゃんとっても澄んだ綺麗な目ミコになる素質があるわ流脈対戦で孤児になったの私と一緒に来ないあなたをお師匠に会わせてみたいお師匠は英雄だけど機械に関してはまるっきりダメでさきっと喜ぶと思うお腹の霊魂も満足できるよどうしてお姉さまは私の話を聞かないのコーロ指示が理解できませんなんでなのコーロ即効性の毒薬が買える店の名前が聞きたい Damn, she really gonna try to kill June? <laughs> Just cause she's afraid of being alone again? パソコン閉じないの明るくて眠れないでしょ必要ないこうしたら孤独感も消えるし船には私もお師匠も乗ってるでしょ孤独ってトロワニーを怒らせたら原圧室に閉じ込められたそして天気を消されてお前らホーリしてるぞって。悪い人だね。うん。でもいなくなったら少し寂しい。なぜかわからないけど。好きだったの。嫌いだったうん。嫌いになるのもまた難しいよね。じゃあ、こうしたら、もし次に彼のことを思い出したら、私のところに来て。私が兄気分になってあげる。エイダは女。ふん。それでも。じゃあエイダネーならいいさやってみないあねそんなに嫌私もミコの塔にいた時ずっと一人ぼっちだったの私だって自分が嫌いそれにみんなも私のことが嫌いでもあなたは違う少なくとも私はあなたのこと大好きだから自分のことが好きになれるように私にお手伝いさせていつの日か一緒に自分を好きになれる方法を見つけましょう私
人に好かれるの苦手そうなんだじゃあお師匠が私にしてくれたみたいにあなたのそばにいさせて。Help not, but I never know with you these days. What? We take that back right now. Old day, Saba. Hello, Rap. I translated it to just Eddie in the English one. Just fine. Just fine. Let's see, Captain Ada Loon Grant. Same ship ID, same class. No expiration available for that one? What? When I saw that the Lumen Association was pouring investments into operating caves, I realized that they were more than just an arbiter for disputes. They were a powerful commercial entity on the rise. Wow! As construction of the cave's mining facilities was only halfway done, it was possible to see ancient Marian structures being carefully moved, piece by piece. Someone from the Association ordered that every part be carefully inventoried. While witches performed rituals and promised the Myrian gods that they'd be taken to a better resting place. Those two are gone again? Didn't they say we'd leave right after checking out the cave? Are you the Red Chamber crew? Excellent! We're currently in the process of moving the spirits to another location. But one of the witches we were working with stomped off after someone was a bit hard on her. You know how it is. Those displaced by the war have a tough time forgiving witches. If I'm not mistaken, your captain is a witch. Could you help us out? I promise we'll treat you well. We'd help you with bring Eddie over to what? What are you talking about? What's that got to do with me? So grumpy. I uh, like, uh, sure. Let's come back some other time. Ada was explaining how the cave operated when the loudspeaker said that sounded out and she was called away. I felt a bit, a little bit lonely, but back then I didn't understand why. Through their rituals, Ada and the witches were able to move the spirits in peace. The people there were extremely grateful to the witches for their help. We paid money. Yeah, we got paid. Can we get paid again? Just one time. God damn it. Supposed to keep paying me though. We've got the forged one now. Wow, there's so many places we could go. A military base. Hmm. We've got the forged thing, so maybe we can escape now. Maybe we could try it out. You only live once. Let's go! You only live a bajillion times in this video game. You just get to reload. Uh-oh, uh-oh. We could fail this, but we'll see. At least we have the visa to try now. After a period of suffocating silence, we received a message. Meseda, please forgive us for disturbing the journey of a first-class United Mining Officer. Ada looked annoyed. Remy, on the other hand, was beaming with self-satisfaction. She was like, yeah, it worked. My forged visa worked. Woohoo! An orbit station located on the border to protect the caves and ensure that the citizens of Aurora wouldn't encroach on the airspace. United Mining pulled no stops when it came to protecting their lumen. What? You mean there's no reason to come over here? They don't give me any exploration or anything. All I do, you do is use this as a point to uh, go to, to then go to somewhere else. I 
Oh, I can do the Reso scanner, I just realized. <laughs> Faint Witch's Star Song. I mean, that sounds pretty quiet. All right. <laughs> A witch's imitation of the star song from deep within an asteroid, revealing a facet of the lumen it holds. Ooh. I mean, I could just run out of fuel again. Wait, what was this one? That was the one I couldn't scan, right? Because, uh, the analysis failed, right? Apparently it's beyond scanning range, but there was one I couldn't scan. Let's just run out of fuel again. No big deal. Maybe. I don't know. Don't throw our border patrol. Oh! Resupply here. Whew. You've entered the airspace of the Lumen Association. If your vessel is not registered, please leave the airspace immediately. Whoa. Uh-oh. This is a warning to the Lumen Seeking Vessel at 6 o'clock. The Mount Aurora Patrol Squad is after us. The product is with you. Toss it out and act like you don't know us. What? There's some unknown ship trying to get it close to us. I'm guessing it's a smuggling vessel. They're trying to frame us by sending a message to us on the public channel. I think we should just get out of here. Leave? Isn't that going to make the patrol squad even more suspicious? Let's clear this up ourselves. It won't be an issue. The patrol squad is already headed our way. What should we do? Mm. I mean, it's really a coin to us. Will the police listen to us or will they not? I think we'll get stopped if we pick the first option. Let's do it. Damn it! How dare they? How dare they be competent? God damn it. You're supposed to beat us up regardless. The patrol squad detained both the ships, and after a thorough inspection of the Red Chamber, they realized we had been falsely accused. In order to prevent damaging the reputation of the patrol squad, they used part of their reserve funds to compensate us. Oh, really? Money! Although things turned out alright, Remy was still upset that Ada didn't listen to her. They gave us five hundred dollars to just keep us quiet. The first time we came here, the atmosphere on Red Chamber was pretty heavy. Everyone was in their own heads, and it was affecting the whole crew. Oh. Everyone's got their own thoughts going on. The Border Patrol office, located far from Aurora City, marked the border between United Mining and Mount Aurora airspace. It had received a variety of complaints, li like those from civilians protesting United Mining's seizure of excavation fines, and their willingness to attack civilian vessels for whatever reason they saw fit. The Red Chamber crew, is there anything you need help with? Last time you helped rescue the immigration convoy, I didn't have the time to properly thank you. Could I do something to express my gratitude? Red Chamber has been having a tough time. I think we need to ask for help. You don't need to say a word. Cave running has its difficulties. There's been reports of missing ships near the border. If you sort through them, I can give you some, some supplies. Oh, uh, sure. Let's see if we get lucky. I can't seem to find a plausible answer. Ada presented her report and the patrol officer did not look pleased. 
Nevertheless, she did compensate us for our troubles. Ooh, we failed. We failed the roll. Rip. Oh, we got a bunch of fuel. Ooh. We can get more fuel? I can try to roll again. See if I get lucky this time. Let's see if we get it. Oh, we failed again. We got we got even worse this time. Dang it. Ah, the youngins from the association. Look at you. Setting so many darn records at your age. Real talents, I'll tell you what. I didn't have the time to properly thank you for helping with the rescue. If you're ever in a bind, just come find me. Is she talking about the immigration convoy? How nice of her to remember us. So cute. In those past few years, due to the expansion of United Mining's range of excavation, the caves of civilian runners on the border started to be taken through dubious political means and sometimes even brute force. As a result, the Lumen Association established a number of border outposts, hoping to moderate the frequency of conflicts. Lumen of the Peaks. Flow without end. This is a licensed operation under the Lumen Mining Act. What could I do for you, runner? Well, let's we'll see what we got, you got for sale. Ooh, Lumen Intel here, too. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, where am I? Bible Thump! I know, right? I can't believe we failed that twice. Now we don't get it. If there was a collectible for not failing, this is toast. No RNG. No RNG today! No RNG today! Think about the border patrol or something. Official Lumen Intel sold by the Lumen Association. Without an excavation permit, it was difficult to purchase. Seems pretty easy to purchase to me. I don't really have that much. Wait, sell the rocket? The, 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 the robot gave us? Nope. Not, no. Just for 400 paltry dollars. For credits. Can't do that. Well, I can't do that. See what's over here. I think Satellite Gitano. As a member of the Galactic Empire, we must reiterate our appeal to peace and weak signal analysis fired. You tell it. You tell the robots rocket that he gave to us. This is a warning to the lemon seeking vessel ahead. Opus three. You have entered United Mining airspace. Please allow us to board for an inspection. If you refuse, we are legally authorized to shoot you down. The Lumen Association said Lumen-seeking vessels almost always need to bribe United Mining. What should we do? Uh, def that'd be insane. Uh, take damage. Let's let's see if the thing succeeds. If this fails, we probably take damage regardless. So. This is the same as that text before. We succeeded! <laughs> Tenth year of the Lumen War. Remnants of this housing satellite still float through space. Survivors say that before it was destroyed, United Mining flew in to rescue the illegitimate daughter of the chairman and Romani spy. Remy refused to comment on the rumor. Hmm. <laughs> Okay. We got a new thing. United Mining Smart Processor, huh? Is it smart? Is it smart? Initially used as a microprocessor for automatic storage units, this technology was replaced after the war. Nowadays, they can only be found in post-war ruins or second-hand shops, if you're lucky. Sometimes I wondered if Remy had installed a few of these on Red Chamber's cameras. Ooh, scrap metal parts. 
This may be just a pile of scrap metal, but the Peekers could always find a way to turn rubble into treasure. I'm getting an abnormal communication request. It's coming from a ship inside the ruins. It's from the Romani clan. But I thought they had all disappeared long ago. May the god of wine bring merriment to the pantheon of deities. Thank you for receiving this message. This is Shia, the Romani clan, servant to the princess. We have been on the run for many years. At this age, I am unable to continue fleeing from United Mining's assassins. I wanted to return here to end my days in peace. It must be fate that we have met. Would you be so kind as to fulfill my final request? Eddie, 16 years ago, the Romani clan pretended to be United Mining's ally in order to attempt an assassination. Ooh. I'm not sure they can be trusted. She doesn't look like a bad person. Um, um, uh, uh, I think she'll stab us, so let's help her out so she can stab us. If she was able to grow up, she'd be about as old as you, she said softly as she looked at Remy over the calm system. Apparently, before the princess passed, she was asked to find the child the princess had with the chairman, but was unable to complete the task. She boarded our ship and left us with her final request. Then she turned and leaped into the darkness of space. What? Okay. Okay. Obtained her body hair adornment. Damn, that's hardcore! Just jump into space. That's what I get for helping her out. Said this was a happy game? I, I lied. I lied! Am I supposed to trust you ever again? Dolby, like 9 out of 10 games I play are sad. You should know this by now. We've had this, we've literally had this exact conversation at least three other times I can think of. Every game I play is sad. Well, not, I suppose not every game. You said it's happy? You lied? I mean, I mean, there was clear sarcasm in my voice, man. It's not my fault you can't tell sarcasm. Anyway, Rumani hair adornment. I've never been able to find the little princess, and the clan's royal bloodline stops with her. If you ever come across her, please give this to her for me. Tell her that even though her mother is known as a traitor, she will always love you. Your name is Miranda Mers. A hair adornment given to us by Shia that was proof of Rumani royalty. I mean... Unless we happen to run into her and she remembers the hair ornament and shit, I don't think we're gonna find her. Thousand Peaks Frontier Memorial. Glory to the United. May fire and iron light the stars. This memorial commemorates all the contributions United Mining has made to Thousand Peaks. Warning, the airspace behind this memorial belongs to United Mining. To avoid being fined, please cooperate with inspecting officers if so required. Cool. In memory of the campaign against the Romani clan. United Mining always said they would bring culture to Thousand Peaks and that control of Lumen resources would be open and free. However, the Peekers found these remarks hard to swallow. United Mining built this memorial to commemorate the victory over the Romani clan. It was filled with written accounts of the 25-year history of the Thousand Peaks development from the perspective of United Mining. The development of Thousand Peaks began with the arrival of United Mining and the subsequent establishment of Iron Wind. Ultimately, United Mining settled the conflicts of the Lumen War, bringing about a long-sought peace for the people. You! Yes, it's you! Traitor! How dare you show your face around here! I... I thought I had taken care of you. 
Uh, forgive me. I... I mistook you for someone else. You look just like the princess. She must be 30 years old by now. Maybe more. If it weren't for her, the Romani clan would still be here today. What the hell is he talking about? I'm already mad enough seeing June and Ada together. Is this geezer trying to get tossed into the engine? Remy, in East Ocean, the elderly is said to hold more wisdom than any book. Maybe we should listen to what he has to say. Uh, uh, both of them are basically telling them to fuck off. You've lost my faith. Is he afraid of me? Well. Um, better luck next week. I don't know. I'll have to do a happy game one of these days, right? I have to do a happy game one of these days. Ah. I'll schedule one in for 2027. Well, goddammit. Uh, okay, close my eyes. Okay, first option then. Remy stormed away, but the elderly man kept on speaking. If you come across one of the Romani, please tell them our story. The princess was willing to sacrifice the clan for her own selfish love. Exasperated, the man hoped to ensure the true history of his clan was known. Given my situation, it wasn't difficult for me to feel for him. Obtained history of the Romani clan. Whoa! Never coming back? Mm, sure. Huh. Sure. The book recounted the tale of the failed assassination attempt by the Romani clan. The chieftain's daughter was said to have been gifted with stunning eyes and beautiful locks. Her duties lay heavy on her shoulders, yet she fatefully fell in love with the chairman, her target, and they eventually bore an illegitimate child. The princess was punished according to the laws of the clan, but her daughter was taken away and lost in the chaos of war, never to be found. Oh my. I don't I believe you. Mm. I don't know. So... Okay, Bohemia. The Rubani clan welcomes all peaceful travelers. Let us leave the wars to the god of wine and the pantheon of deities. Rick, Sark, no analysis, but let's go. Tenth year of the Lumen War. After the collapse of Zhao Ge, the remaining factions became increasingly wary. The Romani clan offered caves to United Mining, hoping to assassinate a top official during a ceremony. The failed mission resulted in the annihilation of both the clan and the caves. Get wrecked, scrubs. Ooh, we got refined Lumen metal play. Everybody clad caught a savage. I know, right? Lumen alloys would not only enhance the ship's armor, they could also be used for storing lumium. You would see massive cylinders made of these lumen plates at the more technologically advanced caves. Ooh. Hey, Oceaner! This is an old United Mining and Romani clan battleground. Oh, background. Battleground! I was trying to say... Go see if there are any usable parts in there. Got it? Sure, but the passageway ahead has completely collapsed. There's no way I can get through. It looks dangerous, June. Forget the mission and head back. What should I do? I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I'm brave. Let's do it. Operating the exploration robot, I was able to dig out a tunnel that I could squeeze through. Inside, I found a conference room that had collapsed. It felt like some important talks had occurred there. Or here. 
After some searching, the effort proved to be worth it. An assassination pact! Whoa! This is now Assassin's Creed Aura. So now assassinate people will be all, all requiescat and pacha on people. For the shared prosperity of United Mining and the Romani clan. A dagger was hidden in the contract supposedly written for a transfer of rights to a cave. This plan led to the demise of the once powerful Romani clan. Get wrecked. I need to get more exploration kits. Hmm. Well, this is where I'm supposed to go for the story, but, 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 my desire for side quests is all the way up here. Dang, that is far. I can buy stuff here, can't I? I'm gonna buy more exploration kits up here. Hey, it's you! Screw off. Oh, I don't have any money. I could never sell the robot. It'd be terrible. Horrible. I could never do such a thing. Or the rocket, I should say. I could never sell the rocket. past this one. This is the one that killed me before. Let's see if we survive this time. Color flare again. I lost some armor. Let's see if the signal works. We, we barely succeeded that one. It's so bright. The last sensory station that United Mining established. Almost as if they were saying even when close to the sanctuary. Or blah, blah, blah. Even as if they were saying even when close to the almighty Ignis. Their fire and iron would burn bright. Cool. There's nothing here though. I came here for no reason. Wait. So the only way I could possibly get here is to go in there. Oh, wait. I have some more coordinates, don't I? Let's back down that way! Well, there's a circle here, right? So there's something in here, right? 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 Let's just wait it out. Oh, we lose armor plates regardless. We might die. The radiance of Ignis can be seen in every corner of Thousand Peaks. Even though solar flares are extremely difficult to predict, the Mirian believers still go on dangerous pilgrimages, taking routes that go frighteningly close to the sun. Ooh, mythical witches star song. Ooh. A witch's imitation of the star song from deep within an asteroid, revealing a facet of the luminous holes. 
You'd sell it. Stop saying you'd sell the rocket. Play Scarwer, yeah. Or, or, or if we if we get another event like that, we're dead. Lemon Cave Nomi. Discovered by Hamster Nomi. Pirates beware. Lest the fires of Ignis scorch your soul. Discovered by Hamster Nomi. System is blocked. Repeating messages. Geologically unstable. Abandoned due to pirate activity. Oh, we're dead. But uh, we raced the shields. We took damage. We waited it out. We took damage. We died! Rest in peace. That's crazy! If you move in that range at all, you get this event. Whoa. If you move that, you get that event. You take damage and you die. I've died like five times. Shut up. No, the rocket down, red ship. Can we just go through without a solar flare? But uh, where am I? Oh, you put me here. Well, then you have to be able to escape, right? Yeah. If it, it, would, it wouldn't soft lock me in here. Doomed to take damage. Maybe. Maybe it wouldn't soft lock me. Hmm. Let's see if we can get make it over there. I made it over there. I'm trying to buy armor now. Wait, what are you doing here? Aren't you supposed to be Aurora? Well, I'm broke again. <laughs> Selling the rocket is illegal. Let's go get a solar flare event. Wait, really? Are you kidding me? Up it a little bit. I lose seven regardless of what I do. Under the light of Ignis, I told Ada about how Miria Taiyang was formed in East Ocean and its relationship to Ignis. She just smiled. Having left the Witching Tower, she believed that everything is a reflection of the soul. Vital handheld recorder. Withered play it. Oh, this is for that hospital place. Oh, one the where was that? I was back down toward the bottom. A recording by James Wong, a famous Mirian explorer. I hope that my words can be passed on. 
I've inhaled too much lumen and my consciousness is fading in and out. I suspect that Ignis is not a god, but a sun, abundant in lumen. Its solar flares are lumen's extra-dimensional thundering, carrying the potential to create lumen, or destroy it. This is how Miria was destroyed. The, they, they're coming for me again. <gasps> Rest of recording unintelligible. Rest in peace, man. That's what I came up here for. I can't scan that though, right? I can't scan that either. Actually, where was the other military base? I visited that one. I did that one, right? Right. The red ones are military bases. Been there. Hmm. Where was the dude's place? Was it here? Or was it the city? It might have been the city. Where was that? It was like rar I think that was, I think it was down there. Well, I gotta get back down there first. I don't think there's anything else up here for me. Well, let's go there first. I could give whatever whatever she said a try. This is the kind of story that will inspire them, she said. I spent some time telling the story about how I was tricked into Bones' base back then. It was a little embarrassing, but the investigators clearly enjoyed listening to my adventure. Money! Money, 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 money! Red Chamber crew, right? Mind helping out with Fortune 9's crime rate? You busted the Bones Brigade operation back then, didn't you? We'd love to pay you for you to come share your experience with us. Right, let's try again. Give me more money. Hey, are you staring? I'm, I'm allowed to want to get more money. Ignis and Helios is the other god, isn't it? Gonna be, it's gonna be cold. Ignis is the fire one, right? Something, something, something. Dang it. Rest in peace, our armor plates. Hold up, out of buddy, I got. Let's see if it'll let me do the thing again. Dang it. I guess I'll actually sell stuff. Not the rocket though, that's illegal. We can't do that. Oop, I backed out too far. You can sell the rocket? You villain. Let's see. Where was it? It was this place, wasn't it? Well, the house be told all. Hmm. 
I'm not mistaken, this is the last recording he made. Pfft. Ridiculous. I know James. That bugger has so much damn energy, there's no way he's dead. I felt terrible, but the nurse and his family couldn't stop laughing. To thank me for providing them with the information, the family gave me a small reward. They seemed in high spirits, but I noticed that they were clutching tightly to the recorder. Got six hundred dollars! No credits. Did we help them out? And this one, I cannot read. I believe. You have to get back over there to find out, I guess. I'm pretty sure I couldn't scan that one yet. Oh, wait. Maybe I succeeded at that one. Maybe it was a different one? Excavation of this cave officially ended in 8518. Abandonment procedures have been initiated. According to United Mining Law, intruders will be sentenced to a minimum of 10 standard years jail time, and their pilot's license will be permanently revoked. Ironwind 18 sounds hardcore. Let's go. We tried to enter United Mining Caves multiple times, and each time we barely escaped with our lives. That ain't. At least we keep getting, uh, the fuel every time we explore. No, oh, not the rocket. That's right. No, not James. He, he died doing what he wanted to do, okay? I, I guess exploring shit. Okay. Four orbis, one circum, two greatest. Praetisidio composes thus. Terra's song shrine is complete. The gates to Benare space-time are open. My song shall guide Lumen from afar. Entering the Banari gates to Ignis, so that me he, he may ingest it, and thereby creating more in abundance. I shall channel his flames with my songs, asking only by the blessings of Helios that Myria may reign eternal. Ooh. Oh. Shattered Myrian inscription. Oh no! We gotta glue this back together! We gotta, we gotta move! We gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta. Inscriptions used by the Myrians for musical residents. The little fragments of luminite within made them a popular item for trade among the people. Wow! Hmm. Oh, is that the one I couldn't scan? I bet that's the one I couldn't scan. But that's the one I couldn't scan. Uh oh. Phew. 
Damn, I got the best possible one. One of these times I'll get five and get destroyed. Oh, that one succeeded, succeeded too. What the heck? Found in 8529 by Rainer Sam. Currently, it is secretly managed by the Lumen Association. The Lumen Association is in the process of applying for an excavation permit. Only plant collection and scholarly research is allowed. Hmm. As more and more Lumen Caves were discovered, I became increasingly agitated about whether or not I should return to East Ocean. Another inscription! Wow! Five Orbis, two Circum, one Gratis. Presidio composes thus. The Lumen are in turmoil, and the heavens blaze without end. Beg Helios to stop Terra's song, so that Ignis' fury might be quelled. And say no way, bro. No way, bro. Uh, blah, 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 blah. hmm. This is probably too far, right? Guess I have to go there. I'm in cave line stir. United Mining announcement. This cave was illegally operated by assassins known as the Romani clan. Abandonment procedures began in 8521 of the Galactic Calendar. Too bad, I'm going here anyway. Eleventh year of the Lumen War. The last cave of the Romani clan was destroyed. It was rumored that the assassination failed because the spy sent to complete the, mis m the mission fell in love with the target. Blah blah blah, target's name is dashed out, blah 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 blah, the chairman of Ironwind. Even to this day, the rumor can be heard in peak care bars. Was it true? Who know? Feel! Tasty feel. Hope so you deserve to get destroyed. What? Can't believe you. Yeah. Thought I backed up for no reason. Oh yeah, I should do the Reso Scanner. I do right, yeah! Well, this is a story one. It's not auto doing it for me. Point one, I already know it's the wrong one. Uh, we'll try it first for the heck of it. This doesn't sound right. Listen more carefully. I already know, see, I already know it's the wrong one. I have headphones. Yeah, this is like, tell us it's the wrong one right here. Look, 
proud, which is star song. That's right. Be proud. Be proud. Be proud. As the years went by, Ada's singing progressed at an astonishing rate. Soon, she was able to imitate any star song that she heard. Sounds like you get better with practice. There's no banner. I won't ban. I've been destroyed five times already. It's fine. Is this the main story one? Directional Lumen Intel. I think this is the main story one. Already, uh, already, uh, yeah, okay, just check it. Well, I do, I'll keep pressing buttons. Oh, <gasps> progress through this cool game. Oh, shit, it's like 2 a.m. in the <laughs> military satellite, Taiwas. Comrades, the Romani clan hereby calls upon you so that we may ensure the songs of witches are lost forever in the depths of space. And the warmongering United Mining is overturned. Weak signal. Analysis failed. Pressing what? Pressing buttons! Buttons. Buttons! Buttons! Oh. Except on a controller. Eleventh year of the Lumen War. The Romani clan's failed assassination led to a final showdown with United Mining. Inexperienced as they were at war, their military satellite was quickly destroyed and the clan was no longer a viable faction. RIP. Ooh, we got something new! Lumen Alloy Armor. Wow! Which of the four do you press? Whichever ones. Bop! Produced by the Romani clan, who placed a very high value on diplomatic relations. Most of these were used on their unique high-speed vessels. After they were defeated, their technology was taken by United Mining, and the defective units were sold on the market for a high price. Red Chamber has detected booby traps left over from the Lumen War in the surrounding airspace. Our heat signal is being monitored. Listen up, Oceaner. Go and dismantle them immediately. June, don't listen to her. That sounds way too risky. You could die. Ada, I'll be fine. Oh, I can do it. Now I need to go buy more exploration kits. Remy was upset that Ada didn't listen to her, but I was able to dismantle several traps with the exploration kit. While I was wondering why there would be a military stronghold there, I found the door to a storage room. Salvage explosives, huh? Are we gonna blow some shit up? Are we gonna blow some shit up? Space junk commonly seen floating throughout abandoned ruins after the war. It was dangerous to transport, but given its range of uses, it was a very popular item among scavengers. Ooh, we can upgrade! Oh, we upgrade. Ooh, the armor plating. Looks like. Wow! Adding bulky armor doesn't look nice, but it will keep Eddie safe. That's right. Dang. You find those. Hey, Nile, What's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing today? I 
I'm gonna go buy more exploration kits. Damn it. What are you damn netting? These aren't as expensive as I was expecting. Those are pretty worthwhile, though. Wow! Got a bunch of these. Do 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 time dive to see for run. So you can do it in 45 50 minutes. You forgot to turn it off again, didn't you? You wrecked. I just do good stuff here. Thought I did. Maybe I did. You turned for it after 33 minutes and has chosen our usual sea fort, but an Ashen Lord is at Marauders. So you'd rather do the Ashen Lord. La 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 la. Do both, right? Asteroid 67. Electromagnetic scan complete. Potentially undiscovered cave. Where's the one for like the secret mission though? Is it that one? I think that's the story one. I probably can't do the other ones though, right? Yeah. So I can't even do the Lumen Intel thing yet. I can't get that far. Enjoying your crappy homemade breakfast burrito after work. Hey, that was better than no burrito. Ask me late to stream as usual. True, true, true. I have to go to sleep pretty soon. I'm busy doing that. Don't long go to sleep. Go up, uh, play a video game thing. Uh, I guess the uh, one for the store. So if I go here, there's going to be a bunch of store. I can't go over there. Hmm. You did forget to vote down the second. Get wrecked. Get destroyed. Get destroyed. Ooh. Ooh. You're sleepy, streamer. Too strong. Oh, no, mama. <laughs> yeah, archive later. Thanks for stream. Have fun. Thanks for stopping by, cat. You have a good sleep. Take care of yourself. I think I will be going to sleep too, actually. But I'm pretty sure this is that secret mission one. I know if I do that, I'm going to have a larger story. Pretty sure it is that. 
Because where else would I go? Uh, this one's just Lumen Intel, it says. I'm pretty sure this is the secret strat... Secret mission thing. <laughs> Potentially undiscovered cave. Because we were trying to get there before United Mining, so... That's gotta be the one! The one! The one! Whoa. Yeah, there's no, like, manual save in this game. It's auto-save when you go to each new location. That's gonna be getting collectibles that require a successful roll. Exciting, aren't they? Because if we fail, we'll have to reload and do whatever we did again. Space Bat makes you think of EVE Online. Never played it, but I hear that game is quite involved. I've never played that either. Basically, this game's a visual novel. And it takes place in space, if you hadn't guessed that. And yeah, your job is to go to these caves and try to find ones that people haven't already found. You're trying to find brand new stuff. Think of it as like, you know, trying to find new islands on Earth or whatever that haven't been discovered yet. And if you find it first, you can claim ownership or partial rights or something. Next side. Can't go to any of these places over here. Because they're all too far out of range. I'd be able to scan this one. Once I go to this one. My story senses are tingling if I go here though. I think I'll trigger more story. And we don't have time for that. It's time to go sleep. I gotta get some sleep. It'll, it'll work out at some more uh, Good enough. Oh, how long do I have to finish this game? I have till the fifteenth, right? And I'm on chapter. I'm on chapter three, part one of like. How many more bars were there at that online start start a chapter screen? There were like maybe two or three more. There was like four or five chapters. I'm gonna have to put some more time into it, so I might have to. Uh, Skip verdict day tomorrow and do this instead. Maybe, maybe. I'll think about it. What should we do on a perfectly ordinary day tomorrow? Super ordinary. No way. Are you sure we shouldn't play this on an ordinary day? I see what you mean. <laughs> you should do verdict day or this game on an ordinary day. Ordinary Friday. That's right. Ooh. You have to put in some time for this game to finish it. I might have to uh, shuffle some other games around to make sure we can finish this game in time. It's definitely taking longer than I expected. I expected it to be through the to the at the end of the story by now, but I am a slowpoke. I am reading all the non already voice text, so you'll think of something cool to suggest. Oh, I see. Is it any of the five hundred other games in this list over here? <laughs> Raffle tease! Or I should start training as a Tekken 8 master. There we go. That's totally it. I'm gonna press all of the buttons. Could be Monica. God damn it. Well, I hope you guys are looking forward to this game all night long Friday night for sure. Well, that was another hip hopping and bopping and popping stream. Thanks for hanging out, Dolby and Nile and Kat and Gino. I know he's asleep though. 
Bots, lurkers, everybody who stopped by tonight. Thanks for chilling on. That's it for today. That's it for today. Whoosh. Whoosh. Wait, I mean, I mean, I mean. I should not bring it around for today. I'm peeking out. I'm peeking out here. I'm not really it for that. Snow away. Go away. Excuse me. What did you say to me? What did you say to me? You can't tell me to stop. Oh, wait. That way. Uh, uh, good night. Sleep tight. No bed bugs. I'll be back before you know it. Definitely not with this game, right? Wink, wink. Probably this game. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see.